Hello. What it do? What it be? What's up, what it is? Hey, 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 hey. Um. We are back again. Back again in. In the Madre. Excuse me, I'm naked. Sorry. Sorry. Wow. Um, Your pro gamer glasses, so you can see all all the I MLG moves you're about to do. I can 360 no scope like a pro now. All right, we're in the Madre. We're just about to walk into the Madre. Chuck is gonna steal 37 gold bars. Um, it's about to happen. Let's just do it. Let's it's about just, to happen. Let's, let's just jump right in. Let's jump right into it. I hope I hope everyone's doing well. Thank you for joining us. Whoever is here already. Twitch cam. Let's go, Leroy. <laughs> Chuckster. And here we go. Bomb color technology because this is before the war. And came in several models. Their pre-war use was up. Oh, get inside. Get in the Madre. Ah! You know what I think was gonna go. Yeah, you're right. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> Goes to the gate, gets your bomb collar exploded right off the bat. If, like, four people just die for no reason. Yeah. What the fuck? Are they supposed to be there like that? Yes, this is all... Oh. This is all... Normal. I do not remember. That's good for you. That must be exciting, like, seeing things that you... Yeah, a ton of XP. Alright. Don't money, move. Money, no, money. don't. Money, money, money. Look up, look up, look up. Money, money, money. Look up, the, look at the stairs. Money, money, money. Whoa. There she is. There she is. You inside. Can you hear me? Power's fluctuating. Emergency power. Oh, you are in. Good. Thought that might be the end of you. Unfortunately, you're... Friends Sorry, old man. Also found their way here, knocked unconscious, just like you. Wondering what happened? You were hit by casino security. Detects anything far, radioactive. It subdues Hello the there. visitors. What it do? Moves them Welcome if back. Hmm. Getting interference from old recordings. The guests who were trapped here shut that noise off. Looks like the casino moved your friends around once inside. Might be useful, or not. Wonder if they came to help or kill you. Still, mm. my signal should work through the speakers now that you're inside. <laughs> well, welcome to the Sierra Madre in all its glory. This is what the old world stood for, even with bombs about to rain down on them. Now, look at it. Beautiful now as guests are all dead. I love this. Better this way. Quiet. How the Mojave should be. Now, with the casino sleeping, it's got places closed off. Won't let you go yet. You'll get there. Trust me. Just need to wake it up. I gotta say, this is like the foyer of the Madre is very underwhelming. The foyer? Yeah. I mean... Well, here's what I picture. So I picture, like, that fountain was probably supposed to be, like, working, like, spitting up water yeah, yeah, yeah. and cool shit. And, like, there are probably, like, you know, vendors all around. And, oh, look at those claw marks on the wall. Oh, wow. That's creepy. That, that's, that's fun. Wow. That's Vera and, what's his name? Uh, Sinclair. Sinclair. I can't, Sinclair! I don't know why I was thinking Hamilton. Hamilton. Have you ever seen that video? The guy shows his grandmother all the Pokemon, and she shows him, she shows Charban, and she goes, "Oh, may I, what's his name, Grandma?" And she goes, "I'll call him Hamilton." <laughs> no. You never saw that, really? <laughs> no, I have not seen that. I'll call him Hamilton. So I think you have to go into the casino. You were fifty, code name. Oh, cool. Did I just go right in. Yes, sir. That's neat, though. Mm -mm. I mean, yes, but like, if he, if he like sees you, sees you, I think you get like. This is the past you're walking through. Oh, hey! Few have ever seen it. Thank well, you. That's cool. No one else. Awesome. Thank hey. you. Hey. I worked hard to get here. It's very Sweet. kind of you. Thank, Thank you. you. I need before I leave, and 
You were the first to do that. Thank you. Now, look for a way to wake this ghost up. Remind it, it's got guests. Okay. So... Bar stairs. Set him to... Let's read the security memo first. Okay. Do you want me to read it? Sure. Security memo, Sierra Madre employees. At the request of Mr. Sinclair, please refrain from tampering with or destroying the security hologram emitters. Remember the holograms creep, keep us and our guests safe. Thanks, Sierra Madre management. So actually, you can't mess with it because it's against the, the employee memo. So actually, you can't, you can't mess, you can't set their behavior. It's against company policy, dude. All right, you're right. We pay our taxes. It's okay. <laughs> don't don't worry about us. Why isn't he attacking you? Because I'm probably back behind a certain line. Uh, There's probably like a cone. Um, that if I'm like within that cone, past a point or something. I I sound like I know what I'm talking about. It's just my friend who designs games and tells me things occasionally. Yeah. Well, I guess maybe we should just tell him. Yeah, I guess we'll just have to break company policy. Yeah, that's the one I think you want. I know there's a stash of something some... Uh-oh. Leave. I think you have to wait for him to, like, go away. The intercom appears to have failed over time. It will, it will only allow one-way communication with another intercom. What the... Why is he coming this way? What you doing, boy? What's he doing? What the fuck was that? He looked like he was, like... Oh, okay. All right. Who's that? What's that Dragon Ball Z move? Uh, who is it, Tien? I, I don't know. You didn't watch Dragon Ball? I wasn't allowed grow, growing up. Right. I watched it a little bit later in life, but, like, See, I mean... I remember, like, I didn't like it, and then when I started getting into anime, everybody was already done with anime, like, when I got into it. So, like, when I switched schools, it was time for... No one else ever will. You want, I think you want Casino Floor West Patrol. It'll give me On both? No, just set Casino Floor oh, West Patrol. You're uh, talking, you're no. controlling one Look for a way to wake this ghost up. Remind him, it's got it like? guests. Click on Casino Floor West Patrol. Now it's set to that one. Oh, now exit. I see, I see, I see. Yeah. I thought the one that was there was the one that so it was now, set to. Now, okay, now okay. let's see he's leaving. Now crouch down. There is a secret stash somewhere here. And I do want to activate it. But there is a bomb collar, John. See, there's coins here. Carefully, you don't get spotted by them. I can take them. Yeah. One Piece is a show that I all... Money, money, money. That I always, always wanted to get into. Uh, I watched it as a kid when it was on Toonami. But I, I never... I can't... Like, I want to watch the whole thing because I like pirates. But I just can't. How can you fucking see me? Because it's 900 episodes till you get to the halfway mark. And that's a lot. And I don't have that kind of time. I hope you don't die. I'm going to blow up. Yeah, I think you're pretty fucked. No, I'm good. Okay. <laughs> that was that's just that's just sheer arrogance. Yeah, no, I know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't do it. No, I got sure? it. Yeah, no, I got it. <laughs> yeah, I got it. I, okay, okay, if you say so. This is all according to my plan. Okay. See, I knew they were gonna do that. Yeah. I it's like that Family Guy joke. Anticipate. So you, you guys are stupid. They're going to be looking for army men as Peter's dressed as a fucking clown. I hate how many Family Guy jokes just live in my head. Dude, we grew up fucking referencing that all the time. Like, I hate that I remember it. There it is. <laughs> beep, 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 beep. That's what I've heard. Like, I heard when Luffy's brother shows up, it's like, all righty. But, uh... Uh-oh. Nah, he's good. I know what I'm doing. That's the character that I, like, wind up accidentally defaulting 90% of the time, too. Hmm. Ah, I don't know what I'm doing. Like... Yeah. 
Nine. Wait, what is this? This door is hermetically sealed due to the gas leak. If you override the door's lock, you won't be able to open it from the inside until you've shut off the gas valve and dealt with dog. Hmm. Big dog in my backyard. A pre-war toaster. Where the fuck does the toast... Oh, it folds. That's yeah. neat. Yeah. Fuck that toaster. Fuck that toaster. Behind you? Nope, never mind. Don't know. It's probably in the room. It's this room. Yeah. I, bet. I bet I got a lockpick into it. So much anxiety. This whole yeah. this whole DLC. Ah. Or in German it's Rufy. That's really fucking funny, dude. That's really funny. I wonder what it is in Japanese. Like, I think all of the Dragon Ball Z characters are based off of vegetables. Like Vegeta is vegetable, Kakarot is carrot. Mm -hmm. Gohan is egg. Oh. Piccolo is pickle, obviously. Um, Yamcha is something. Yeah, Johan... No, 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 I'm sorry. Gohan is rice, because Gohan Tamago is what I make for dinner. Just rice and eggs. That's where I got the idea from. Thanks, ah. Japan. <laughs> Thank you. This sounded so like... No, no, I meant like, 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 thanks, Japan! Japan. It's cool. I mean, it's a little too, you know, in America, Rufy is uh, not a fun drug. Been reading this over. In the event of a fire, chemical leak, nuclear attack, or other threat to the casino, the interest or ex I'm sorry, the interior or exterior doors will hermetically seal to prevent harm coming to the guests. During this time, holograms will be deployed and assume threat status until the lockdown is ended. Guests guess can't be too careful these days so i guess you can't be too careful these days that's not written well still what if there was another leak at the switching station not to mention the gas valves in the kitchen if those got hit the whole casino's a torch so i wonder if that's like the cloud itself hmm hologram service protocol 2.3 hologram holograms are programmed with service protocols and security protocols a service protocol protocol hologram performs a specific function. Greeters, simple vendors, or in the case of the Madre Casino itself, or in the case of the Sierra Madre Casino itself, even monitoring gambling tables. When service holograms follow simple routines, they are incapable of performing any security function. Holograms can't move beyond range of their emitters and are best when used for a simple localized function. Cool. Wow, a hard locked Ooh, what's that on the thing? Ooh, piece of candy. Another Ooh, piece another of candy. another fucking family guy joke. Scotch. You like scotch? I mean I don't really like drink, I know. Yeah. Harmonica? Pretty much the only thing I ever cared for really was whiskey. In my younger days, vodka, but like now oh. I'm like. Uh. Yeah. What kind of music do you like, Chris? Music? Yeah. Dude. I really wish I could say. I really just like whatever I think is good, which, like transcends like i basically i at least dive a little bit into every genre mm -hmm. um there's something in a genre that i can like usually um mostly though i mean i guess i'm like uh gosh i don't know like uh i like really experimental weird stuff like the weirder it is the better what's your favorite band um my favorite band yeah uh like of all time? Yeah. Uh, that's kind of a hard. That's nice. That's very nice. I would put that on and repair your old one with that. You mean use the old one to repair it? Right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, but like, 
It's funny because like so, so Muse mm -hmm. is a band. Oh, shit. oh shoot, that I've like been into since I was really really young. Mm -hmm. um, I know like probably out of all the bands that I like, like I know the most about them. So, I mean, I guess like I could say like that would be like my favorite. And they were also the first band that I saw live. Um, you know. But I feel like another band that I would just have to mention just because like they like have such a special place in my heart is Queen. Mm -hmm. I love, Freddie Mercury is my favorite vocalist of all time. Period. I don't think I fucking... I, I love his voice so much. Um, no, I feel you. I get that. But uh, these days, actually, my, like, favorite go-to artist when I'm, like, cleaning or doing anything and I just want to listen to some music is Jack Stauber. So it's a little bit of my music tastes. I've been going through a soul phase for a long time now. Like, a lot of Motown shit. That's, like, always good. Yeah. I've never used that ever. You know what's funny? Neither have I. Because uh, I just, I don't know. I get it here at the Madre, and then, like, I always save it, tell myself I'm saving it for something special, and then I never end up, like, doing it. Focus, hocus, pocus. I'll look that up. What kind, what, what kind of uh, music is it? Because I, like I said, we're going through, like, a Motown-y, jazzy soul phase, but I'm, uh... I can't get in there. I'm more of a like a like a, like a rap man, a rapist, if you will. Um, how fucking funny is rapist? How fucking funny is that? That's pretty. I heard That's rapist something. on a, on a YouTube video. The guy's like, I'd make a song about that. He's like, Oh, you make music? He goes, I'm a rapist, and I I oh almost gosh. shit my pants. <laughs> I bet you're not gonna be able to get through that door. Yeah. Wow. How do I get out? Are of you here? trapped? That'd be so. F and so the courier. And so the courier was trapped. Became trapped. No, oh, you can get over doing that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They did that on purpose. Yeah, thanks, Obsidian. Th yeah, thank you. You guys are pretty smart. Oh fuck. Wow, I'm going so fast. Oh fuck. <laughs> fucking, hey, what oh the fuck God. are you kids doing on my fucking lawn? It's not. It's rock if you can call it that. Okay. Whoa. I fucks with some death grips. I was just about to say, how do you feel about death grips? I fucking love. Death I grips. love like when I was saying like weird stuff. Like death grips is one of my favorite bands. I used to that hate I've ever death heard. grips. Yeah. I used to. F I used to like if someone put death grips on and I was hanging out with them, I'd be like, we're not friends anymore. I can get past this. Okay. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! We're friends. Now. <laughs> stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Jackal! 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 It's Jackal. That's another Family Guy joke that just lives inside of my face. Uh, I was never one for metal. See, and like I actually have like I look I listen to some metal too. Um, not like, um, gosh, I don't know how to describe. So like I listen, I technically I don't know because like I'm not very knowledgeable about like the subgenres and like related genres of metal. So like I recently, so like I haven't really been listening. Like I haven't. Swing. I didn't have like a like any heavy bands that like really piqued my interest for like the last couple years, and um, I recently listened to Knocked Loose for the first time, and I actually really liked Knocked Loose. I really like their vocalist sound. He sounds really fucking. He just sounds so pissed, and I love it. I remember. Who showed you Knocked Loose? Uh, my buddy Mike. Okay. I also have a very good friend who, uh, like, got me into that. Like, I had a funny music background growing up. I technically was basically only allowed to listen to, like, Christian music. And then, like, my first, like, introduction to, like, listening to actual worldly music was, like... Secular, if you will. What? Did your parents ever use that term? Secular oh, music? I, maybe, I just didn't. That's like non-Christian music. It's, it's called secular. Well, what, the um, fuck do, what do I do? What do I do? do Where do like, I go? Do you, do you like doom metal? So is that like... That's like sludgy fucking like... Uh, Ghost. The band Ghost is, is considered I haven't actually metal. listened to it's, it's, Ghost um, much. 
I think I've heard like one or two songs, but it's like atmosphere. I don't know if atmospheric is the right word, but it's like. Go to that terminal. Can you like? No, get I had into to move it? the guy. He was fucking. Cause well, cause you need to move the guy that's. Is that reinforced? Ooh. Hey. You need to move the guy that's sitting, standing in that doorway. That every time you were crawling on top of the thing, mm -hmm. you would see. You. I know. I know. He's the guy you gotta. I move. moved everybody to the bar. Everybody. Everybody's in the bar. Okay. I think so. Wow, it actually worked. Haha, -ha, security. Fun fact, I remember one playthrough, I when I got back from the Sierra Madre, I gave uh Papa or Jones. Papa? I forget who it was. Who was it? Now I can't remember. I gave somebody the Sierra Madre armor, and I thought they looked so bad. I think it was actually Raul. Before I that finished his sense. quest, I gave him that and he like looked sick. I wanna do we had plans for what we were gonna do when we get back. I oh I remember what it was. What, from the Madre? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm the same way. I don't really like a lot of new stuff. I remember when I found, when I found a Letro, well, look at my health. I found a Letro swing. I remember going to school and these, these two kids, uh, we called them, I mean, not to their face, but we wound up calling them the Dirty Super Mario Brothers because they were twins. Oh my gosh, and, I know. You're about. <laughs> and they had like long hair and like wouldn't bathe, and they had like these shitty scruffy beards. And I was like, "Yo, dude." Uh, yeah, they would they would they would <laughs> anime <laughs> run through the halls and shit. Yeah, which is funny because you and I didn't. What the fuck? You what and the I, fuck? You and I didn't go to school together for very long. Yeah. But, like, you know who I'm talking about. Yeah, no, I do. Which is super oh, fucking yeah. funny to me. But, um. I remember I was like, dude, have you guys heard of a Electro. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Papa remembers. I was like, have you guys heard of Electro Swing? And they're like, yeah. I was like, dude, but, like, what do you mean? You you know about this? And he's like, yeah. Because he, he, the they were super into dubstep because they would anime run through the halls. Yeah. This is also, like, 2014. 2013. Yeah. yeah. And, uh... I listened to a little bit of a Knife Party in my day. Dude, Knife Friday. Party fucking ruled. Shouldn't be... Fucking... I'm just gonna try this. Fortune favors the bone, right? <laughs> hey, it's like straight up like, what the fuck? Hey, hey, ho, ho. There you go. Hopefully I don't you think... I don't, I don't think... I think... I think oh, you fucked shit. up. I think... I think... Now you fucked up. I think you fucked up. It can I think all genres have have the ability to be decent. Damn it. Fuck. I'm telling you, bro, there's a terminal somewhere. Terminal these nuts. Blah, 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 blah. Oh shit! I, I saved behind him, so we're good. No, I know, but like that's still I didn't think he'd actually take you out. What weapon do I have on my back? That's the hollow rifle. Why? I don't know. I just saw you equip it, and I was just kind of like, oh, okay. I didn't even realize I did it. How many shots are I for this? 19. Huh? <laughs> That's an interesting, uh, I think the hologram's glitching out. Cool. I think this would be a chuck weapon. Chuck! Do 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 do. Do, 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 do. Alright. So check the current status. Check hologram status. Bar door. So this guy can stay. Okay. No, he can't, because I need to get out. Uh. Oh wait, where's his where's his emitter? We need to find his emitter while he's in the doorway. You know what's funny? When you shot the uh, emitter the other, the one time, I like didn't even know you could do that. Really? Yeah, so I not... thought you had to repair them. No, I don't listen to K-pop. I don't really listen to a ton of stuff that I don't understand, to be honest with you. This, is, this, is, this needs to be fucking fixed. Hold on. But I, the K-pop fans, dude, are fucking lethal. <laughs> Let's see if that does anything. Uh, it's, I don't think it is. 
think it's gonna bring that guy. Yeah, it's gonna bring him to the stairs. So now he's gonna be standing by the stairs. But that's not the guy that was on the, under the archway. Dude, there. I don't know. I hate this part. It's the so. The way we're gonna figure out which terminal controls that guy is by ruling out which controls which terminals control the other guard. So we know that that terminal right there controls that guy. Yeah. That guy we don't give a fuck about. So we're gonna go up these stairs, right? Now go left. Oh fuck. And then we're gonna hop over the. So bottom. okay, so this terminal in. Oh look at that. This terminal in here controls this fella. Yeah, the one that was upstairs. This what about guy. that terminal right there? Wait, where behind is he you? now? There oh, he is. Fuck, I can't get out of the door. Hold on. This one I don't think has anything. Oh shit. Yeah, if you okay, he's following me. If you could just find instru instrumental actually just kill me. If you could find instrumental tracks of it, it'd be probably enjoyable. So, yes, go in there. Can you go to the left? No. Okay. That terminal, there must be a way to get into it. What's it called? What's the terminal called? This one? Yeah. Security Management Control Terminal. So that's going to, I guarantee you. Oh, I know where it is. I, it's going to control that I one guy. I know exactly so we have where to... it is. Hold on. Okay. I remember. I remember. I remember, Gandalf. I was there. I was there wow. 10,000 years ago, or whatever the fuck it was. I don't even know what you're referencing. Lord of the Rings. Ah, uh, never seen. Lord of the Rings is pretty good. What about that one? Oh, I know this, this is nothing. No, I'm trying to see. When I was on, when I was doing this on Discord, there was somebody who would always have the wiki open on how to do quests. So anytime I got stuck, they'd be like, do this. I, I know, I know I should. I just, no, you go, it, it made more of an emphasis. Um, I have no real interest in fantasy. Um, says the kid who got paid to play D&D for a very long time. I just don't really have any... Mm. Status. Is this the one who's who's guarding the, the doorway? I think so. Bar door. Do I guarantee you, you don't want to mess with him. Okay. I feel like from what I remember, every time I've done this, I leave him guarding the bar okay. door. Uh, yeah, I don't have really any huge interest in... I don't there has anything. to be a fucking key in here. Alright, then look into every fucking nook and cranny. I, we, we used to have a friend, the mm -hmm. one who died... Uh, whose dad played the shit out of Fallout 3. And I remember he told me, he was like, I go in a building. He goes, I'm in the building for an hour. He goes, I take everything off the shelf. I dump out every box. He's like, I search. I look. Mm -hmm. And then one Christmas, I remember... I bet it's behind this fucking door. Nope. One Christmas, he had... Uh, Did you look in that desk that was not empty? The one to your right? Okay. Fuck. Uh, maybe I don't remember what I did. Yeah, I don't know. It just didn't. It didn't. It's never done anything for me. I like the. Uh, we were just having this conversation the other night at dinner. Um, I like how they filmed three movies together and then said, "Fuck it, we're gonna put it. O we're gonna put it out over an amount of time." Uh, that was cool, but I don't know. It doesn't. Nothing for me. Is it up here? I like how the ceiling is like falling apart. Alright, I'm gonna give myself five more minutes before I just cheat. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm trying to think of what you could try next. So, I have an idea. Go down the stairs. Now, slowly go left, look at the, look down the hall, look for a blue circle thing. Oh. 
That's probably reinforced. Yeah. That's not. Sierra Madre office key. Fucking okay. So now. Star Wars, Chris. I like Star Wars. I it's I have a funny relationship with Star Wars. So I grew up with Star Wars. I love Star Wars so much. And um, there was like this. I don't know if anybody else knows this game. Uh, my older brother and I we grew up playing Jedi Knight. Uh, either Jedi Knight Two or Jedi Knight Three Jedi Academy, and we would mod the shit out of it. Um, and that was a lot of fun. Why are you back here? Is where it took me. Huh. Well, you don't want to be here. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Actually, hold on a second. Bones like. Yeah, that, I I loved it. We I remember we would like turn Jedi Knight into like other games. Like I remember we like made it so that we could like spawn enemies that were like. How do I give things? What do you mean give things? Oh, there we go. Return. We would like, um, like spawn different enemies that were like more like Zelda enemies, and then make our character like Link, and like, like load levels. It was a lot of fun. Um, and then like when I got older and I like watched the Star Wars movies again, I like realized I was like, man, you know, like I love these still, but like, it took me to like get older and realize like, man, they're pretty cheesy, and like the scripts are like. Not super great, but like you know it's really one of those funny? funny things that I just I still love it though, and I think that's the thing is that it just kind of to me seems like it's like one of those things that's like it's more for like the you know childish brain of like ooh Star Wars it's and I love it I love it it'll always be a firm part of my my personality honestly. So what's the fucking point of it? Oh, I bet I can go downstairs or is that downstairs? No, that what you the got fuck you got the key right? Yeah. So, so what's the no, fucking point? No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. Is, was there a safe up there that was locked? Because if there's a safe, that might have the password to w the terminal. But why would it? Why would it, a key open both a door and a safe? No, did it open a door? Yeah. It opened that door. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. My whole thing with Star Wars is that it's cool. If that's what you grew up with, that's fine. I just know it's not for me. Like, I got excited when they made the new trilogy. Because I was like, okay, cool. I get a trilogy to grow up with. Look behind you in this. Look around this room slowly. Like, not like super, super slowly. Look up in, like, the corners. Because I swear that blue circle's around here somewhere that is his emitter. Mm -hmm. Damn, I don't see it. If anybody watching knows what to do, please let me know. Maybe it's in here. Hey, what about that terminal? Is that? This just tells you. Oh me. fuck. Okay. Damn. All right. Whoa. Fuck. I hate when they do that. They I, like name uh, something, and it's like, oh, you know, this got to be important. No, it's not. Dude, I almost started swinging. Uh. Empty whiskey bottles. Oh, there's a thing with George Lucas that he. Uh, he like watched the prequels. He watched the prequels and he's like, I think I made this too long. Like there's footage of him being like, I, I fucked up. Huh. I did this wrong. I fun fact actually growing up also really liked the prequels. Um I remember growing up, like I loved Star Wars episode three so much. And I know like, you know, people talk trash on it, but like Hold on. I loved episode three so much. And um, I loved like seeing you know everything come full circle and seeing Anakin become Darth Vader. It was just, it was really cool. I don't. What and I, I like the lightsaber fight scenes so much better. Nothing is even in like there. so much better in the prequels. This is gonna be dumb. I bet something's in here. Nothing's in here. That's what I th I th I thought growing up. And at this point, I mean, I. Technically, like, I, I I haven't really, I haven't watched the Star Wars movies, like, all of them in a while, but, like, yeah, I feel like if I were going to be most excited for one of them, it's going to be episode three. Dude, the fight scene on Mustafar? Bro. Like, there's something also just, like, so symbolic and awesome about, like, on this, like, volcanic planet, you just see two blue lightsabers. 
like striking at each other. Who are the two blues? It's Anakin and Obi Wan. Oh, this is the end. At the end. I see. I see. And it's just like it's just one of these like aesthetically like what the fuck type things at least for me when i was a kid watching it i'm just surprised they didn't make prequels to who was fucking anakin's dad that's the thing he was like he was like jesus he was literally there was no father oh wow they talk about that in episode is one is he like the old dirty bastard because there is no father to his style one person out there is gonna get that thank you <laughs> thank you one person who listened to hip-hop growing up thank you that's in a that's in a Wu Tang song. They're talking about everybody. Stuff. I hear they ain't nothing to fuck with. That's that's I hear the number one most important thing to know. If if you need to know anything, it's that the Wu Tang Clan ain't nothing to fuck ain't with. nothing to fuck with. Yeah. So I don't know what I'm doing. I literally blah, 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 think blah, blah, at this blah, blah, point, blah, blah, blah. you know what you Wait, should. Wait, is even there? Yeah, that dude, yeah, and that dude, yeah. So I honestly think at this point. Yeah, I know what you're saying. Oh, okay. Saying. Okay. No, no, what's up? It looks too. Fuck! There's his emitter. <laughs> Let's see what the cell looks like. That's neat. Well, I'm not sure if it was canon again, but it was Palpatine. Oh, Anakin's dad is Palpatine? Really? Wait, what? No spoilers for the new new movies, because I haven't... I know Chris hasn't seen them, and I haven't. All right, yeah, just do your fucking thing there, bucko. <laughs> he made him appear inside of Anakin. So, Darth, you're telling me Darth Sidious manifested... Right, I understand. So you're saying that Sidious... Like, manifested, using the Force, manifested Anakin in What's-Her-Face. Yeah, use, using the, as they say in episode one, the Metachlorians. Yeah, like, I, like that's another thing I don't like, is like, oh, hey, here's the first movie where, um, the first three movies where, like, being a Jedi is a religion, and it's something you can study and become better at, but some people are just kind of better at it from birth, and then here's the prequels. Okay, you have a predetermined level of how Jedi you can actually be. All right, George, thanks. I just think he's a, I just think he's a hack. I'll be honest with you. I just think George Lucas is a fucking hack. All right. He's made three movies his entire... I mean, three movies that are series his entire life. He made... We need to figure this out. Two movies, and then he did Star Wars. And the two other movies fucking suck, too, from what I understand. We need to figure out how to, to, to get this thing done. I guarantee you it's not this dude. Alright. Starting fucking I'm starting. It sucks because I think the reason I don't know what to do is like that terminal, I'm sure that terminal that's hard is the one you need to get that guy to move. I guarantee you, but like well not like, guarantee you, but fuck. I'm pretty sure. What am I supposed to do? You move him and then uh No, like I'm I'm with you, but like what am I supposed to do? Like if I can't move the terminal Okay, that's so what we're gonna do. I just don't fucking care. I just want to be done with this. We've been playing for fucking forty-five minutes. Yeah, that's the that's what I'm saying. I'm trying to get shit accomplished. I wonder if like Josh Sawyer like plays as. That's back. true. What? That's like. That's Josh shit. Plagueis? That's true. Darth Plagueis, that's the guy who trains Sidious. Um, Sidious tells a story about Plagueis. I, I know the scene three. that you've heard the tale of Doc, Doc Plagueis. The yeah. yeah. I love democracy. <laughs> what the fuck did that do? Absolutely goddamn nothing. Nothing, yeah. Nothing, yeah. I'ma hack you. Cash is Got a hernia. <laughs> I wonder if you could do unlock for this. I doubt it. Did you ever see that? Mm. I really miss my. Mm. White people, white people. <laughs> Just turn that end to a W. Back to the song. <laughs> I saw him in the bed. 
I know. said, oh, you did. My friend said, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> and then I said, no, 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 no. Fucking so. I remember when that, like, blew up. Some a rapper that I follow was like, if you haven't heard this yet, now is the time. Like the di- like it blew up for one day, had like two million views out of nowhere, and I just remember going, I boom, boom, really, <laughs> his other stuff is really fucking funny too. I bet. What, oh man. What do I do? What do I do? What do okay, I do? Okay, if you were gonna use cheats, go back. No, go back to the 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 terminal that has a hard lock on it. That one right there. Unlock that one using. Alrighty. Commands. I wonder if the developers are just like, yeah, you know what, like, I wonder how much they cheat. I wonder how much they remember of building this. Okay, so, unlock electrical closet door, set calf- set behavior cashier's counter patrol. Yeah. Yeah. So now, technically, um, I'll eat some fucking pumpkins. You just need to get- now that guy that was standing there that was trying to get to the- to the closet, you couldn't get there? Now he's moved. But- the, the place you're trying to get to. So, but now you'd have to just get around him. You can either just run past him, or you can re-program uh, him to guard somewhere else. But Yeah, now you should be able to get to where that, you need to go. That, like, didn't need to happen. Why was that the way that it was? Why are you going to the lobby? Because, Chris. Okay. I almost called you Nick. I don't know why. Nick Valentine. I got Brendan Valentine. Fuck Red Dead 2. Fuck that game. I wanted to like that game so badly, dude. That's like one of my... <laughs> no, this motherfucker's here. Yeah, so now you can go over the thing. Over there. Oh, wait, hold on a sec. What's Jump that? On it. It's a shot glass. Oh, this. and then you jump to the yep, and then you go through there. Yep, uh huh. Yep, and then you just flip that switch there. Cool. Thank Christ. Look it up. You can gamble now. If you had any chips. I do. I have plenty. I have enough to gamble. What game do I Damn hate? The Brink. Dead echoes in the frequencies. Casino security is shutting down. Opening up its vendor and gambling programs in the back Ooh. casino. <laughs> Still might be something for sale. Not a Maybe big fan of Brink. help you now. Security shut down. After you're done looking around, head to the lobby Shame and we'll deal with your friends. So now you find a vendor, like there's the oh, roulette Blackjack. thing. Blackjack, I think, is go to your left. I think it's in the back, in the back room through there. Go around the corner, I believe. Dude, he is. Sorry, let me just see what time it is. I don't like, um, I have no caps. I'm so glad Papa said what I was thinking when, <laughs> when Codename asked what games do you hate, I'm like, oh my god, don't get Vince started. I, <laughs> like, I, I, I really, like, <laughs> resent that. Like, for such a long time, all of my friends just were like, oh, yeah, here's this angry fucking asshole. Well, I mean... And I'm I, really not that angry. I just, I think you just get very, when you don't like something, you just get very passionate about it. That's it's, all. It's like 2 p.m.? Um... Yes, it why, is 2 p.m. Why are my stats the, like this? Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, it's 2 p.m. Okay. I'll never get used to that. I don't like Brink. I think Brink was a fucking letdown. Red Dead 2 was a massive letdown. Um, I've said it before and I'll say it again. The point of Red Dead 1 is it's not the story of John Marston, it's the story of Jack Marston. And, uh, that being said, Red Dead 2 should have been the story of John Marston through the gaze, the guise of, there we go, through the guise of, um, where the fucking boy? 
Arthur Morgan, but it just it was just an excuse to overwork their employees. Max Bet? Yeah. Hell okay. Yeah. Did you save before this? It'd be kind of nice to just like. Yeah. Don't you? Yeah. <laughs> But I mean, like, this is without, like, mods. This is just the way the good lord intended. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, we technically have 19. Well, I hear you, but I wanted to... I wanted to try something different. I want we won. Chips. Cool. All right, so now we're at... I can keep going hard. Okay. I would stay. I want to, um, I want to get kicked out. Like, I want them to be like, you can't do this anymore. I don't... I wonder if I that even happens. Down. Yeah, it does. I'm pretty sure it does. At the Madre? I'm like 90% sure it does. Did I win? Wow. Yeah. Hot damn. I just don't like Red Dead 2. To be completely honest, I just don't like it. I lost the game. Good for you. Because I just slipped into I just... I'm not... Don't worry, Papa. I'm not going to go on a massive rant. I just don't like Red Dead 2. Uh, I put an insane amount of time into it. And it just wasn't for me. Break even. I'm okay with that. 21. 300 chips because it was a 21. I'm just going to buy so many stim packs and never have to worry about it ever again. And I'm not cheating. I'm using the game's mechanics. Oh, no. This is literally what yeah. I do to get... Yeah. Like, when... I forget who... Ooh. Maybe it was you... Um, we're watching me play, and you saw that I had, like, 150 stim packs. And the reason I have 150 stim packs is because of a mix of this and, um... The Fuck. big empty actually helps, really? too. Because, uh... It's nice to, like, um... Just get a bunch of, like... You can use the plants. If your science is high enough, you use the plants there. You make a bunch of salient green... And you just make a bunch of Xander root and Brock flour, and you get some empty syringes, and you can fill all of them. You can make a yeah. fuck ton of stim packs. Also, the big empty, if you have high enough science, I think it's 25 or more. Every time you go to like a sciency, like chemistry set looking thing, mm -hmm. you get five stim packs. Are you fucking kidding? Yes, me? you activate That's it, you get wild. you have five stim packs. That's wild. You get an option actually. You can either make five stim packs or you make drugs like Fixer, Psycho, Buff Out, and all that shit. But I always do stim packs. Cause See, what hurt me about Red Dead 2 is that when I beat it and I got to play as... Or when you when you beat the first portion of the game and you're in that epilogue. Um, and you get to play as John and you get to see how John built... What is that? That's fucking 17. 17, yeah. Double down. Fuck it. Oh, boy! Uh, my luck's an 8. Um, but yeah, we don't. Wait. You were comp you get, you're given a complimentary gift. So were you just kicked out? No, I can keep playing. I can do that two more times before they're like, get the fuck out. I don't remember how high the um, the limit is, but I've won two hundred, two thousand, two and yeah. a half thousand chips. Um, no, we don't. But oh fuck, watch me get a twenty-one. Um, did I lose? We broke even. Wow. Uh, what's Max bet s? I didn't like how, like, I loved how when you beat Red Dead, that's just a regular hit, right? Yeah. 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 Um, if you're 16. feeling, yeah, if you're feeling brave, double down, but. I can't. Double down's only, uh, it's only uh, the uh, first uh, go. Uh, I'm gonna, yeah, fuck it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm staying, because yeah, there's no way I'm gonna. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Fuck, hold on. I was, I was in the middle of something. Um, I'm not yelling at you. I'm sorry. Um, you beat Red Dead... The, the end of Red Dead 2, I like how you get to play as John. You get to to, to hear about how he made Beecher's, Breacher's Hope and all that shit. That's really interesting to me. That's, like, my favorite part of the game is the end content of it. But, okay, good. But, like... The problem with it was, like, I was reading all these people that are like, oh, this part's, this part's so fucking boring. Who wants to play this? John can't even swim. This and that. And I'm just like, you didn't play the first one. Spoilers. I didn't spoil it. I just say you get to play as him. I didn't say what happens. You feel lucky in the 200 chips. 
Double down. Because right now it's either an 8 or a 16. Okay. I lost one chips. Okay. 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 19. Uh, my luck's an eight. It's an eight during the day. That's a stay. That's gonna fuck me, but that's a stay. Wow. He busted. I want to say the max that they can give out, like, in winnings, is ten thousand chips. Yo, same. Same peach treats. <laughs> I, I still don't know how to play Caravan. I... I okay. Vince we, has described it to me, but I still, like... Uh. We, we're we going to play Caravan, because I kind of know how to play. I have a Caravan deck, because it comes with the uh, the special edition. So I yeah. I have a deck. I kind of know how to play. It's kind of blackjacky, but, like, it isn't. There'll be a time we sit down. Like, yeah. there, there'll be a stream dedicated to just learning how to play. So It'll be NCR Chuck plays yeah. Caravan. Yeah. What did I do? I won 400 chips and I fucking hit a button that I wasn't sure what I was doing. What did I do? Could you Google something for me, Chris? And I lost. Could you Google how much are you? can you win at the Madre? That's going to be a double down. I'm feeling lucky. Ooh, look at that. Did I just win? God damn. Look at that. Big pog. Big fucking pog. That's, I'm going to have to stay with that. I like the animation for the cards. You break even. I'm okay with that. Feck the. That's an Irish ass word right there. I haven't heard anybody say feck in a long time. Chris, what do you know about feck? Huh? What do you know about the word feck? Uh. I, I know it as a, a word, a funny way of saying fuck. Yeah. It's, uh. It's, it's like an Irish slang term. I'm surprised you never heard Olive's dad say it. Oh. Okay, now I'm losing chips. All right, dude. Well, stop it. Like, the fuck? Start winning. Break even. Eat my ass. Uh, this must be riveting gameplay. Trying to... I don't know where how to... No, I think it's because you said the word fuck, and then you brought up how the game was in German, and I think Twitch's automatic thing meant, thought you were saying that you didn't like that group of people. I lost two, what the fuck? I wonder if I would make more money. Oh, that's 20 right there. Okay, I'm tired of losing chips. I'm walking away. Oh, you're walking away now, so I don't need well, to. Well, no, 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 no. It, it's still, it's still. What do you call it? Like, it's still a limit. But I want to play the slots because I don't think I've ever played the slots in this game. I think that one's. Yeah. yeah. What? I. What do you want the most of? You want sevens, okay? Uh, spin. <laughs> what the what fuck? did I win? Yeah, I don't know. I feel like... Okay, I'm not doing this. This is stupid. I get uh, nothing out of that. I get more out of blackjack. I, I mean, I feel you. I feel that way a lot about Americans sometimes. Uh, okay, just instantly lost. What the fuck happened?
Maximum winnings, 10,000. I thought so. Thank you, Chris. <laughs> Do it, man. Did I lose? God fucking damn it. I just, I want to win the money and then buy all the, the what do you call it? And then just breeze through. <sighs> Stim packs. Wait a minute. Do we have a stealth boy? I don't think so. I can check. We there, that's either. There's probably some, there's probably one somewhere. I'm gonna lose. Hey, Lanius. Hello. Yo. Welcome. Oh, way. <laughs> Vale. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh. Hella, yeah. Damn. We're yeah, I 20. have to shit on, uh, on games, Papa says. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, fuck Brink. Brink was like, oh, this is a game with, like, wow with a stupid amount of customizable options and then it was like 36 options with like maybe 10 different color schemes and then it was like every character played the same it was not a fun game oh good tonight the leg it look what the leg it oh has to wow <laughs> all way true to ncr Thank you for being here, Codename. It was, it was nice to see you again. I'll wait you to the courier. <laughs> Be safe. I'm gonna stay on that one. I can't... What the fuck happened? I have an 8. That's almost a 9, which is practically a 10. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Well, when you put it that way... Oh, wait. That's an True to guys I believe in myself. Oh... That's a stay right there. I'm gonna lose. Oh, wow. Okay, come on, come on, come on. That's it. See, I don't All have right. a problem. I can stop whenever I want, but the problem is I haven't won enough yet. So I can't stop. But I can stop whenever I want. Right. Yeah. It's a 10. Let's hold on to the 10. John Henry Eden. <laughs> There's actually, you want to hear something really interesting that I read? And I kind of wish Codename was here, because yesterday Codename was saying about how much they like Fallout 4. Mm -hmm. In the beginning of Fallout 4, if you listen to the dialogue on the TV, the news reporter says about something about baseball being America's pastime. John Henry Eden says the same exact line about Ameri baseball being America's pastime. John Henry Eden is an AI made up of various, it's every single president ever, every recording of a president and news reporters because that's who addresses the country so that line itself was taken from that news reporter on the day that's the bombs so fell in Boston funny. Yeah. yeah and the guy who posted the video on YouTube I was reading the comments or the description he was like I heard this when I started the game up but no one ever said anything about it so I thought I'd make a video so like this is just an easter egg that's been sitting there for god knows how long and one dude was like ah someone will fucking figure it out yeah. Like. That's crazy. Dom Henry. Fuck. Yeah. Good luck, all bitch. Oh. See, when I get to, when I get to, like, 5,000 chips, I'll stop. 5,000? I can, I can stop whenever I want, Chris. Yeah, I know. That's what they all say. You broke even. I'm just choosing that whenever I want. Of course, he's right. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Why did I hit that? Why the fuck did I hit that? Because I was reading. That's why. See, once again, reading has fucking failed me. Um. No. I, no, that's the old no, world flag. No, that's the flag. pre war flag. I don't have yeah. an enclave flag. I want an enclave flag. Fuck me. Oh, my God. Um. I have. You can't see it. No, I can't move the camera. I have to fucking set everything back up. I have a Kaiser flag, a GNN flag, and a pre-war flag right there. And on my door, I actually have... Can you see it? No, you can't. On my door, I have an NCR flag. I kind of like this Fallout series a little bit. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of it. 
Yeah. It's kind of like a It's thing. pretty awesome. It's cool. Yeah. Why the fuck am I losing? You win some, you lose some. You don't you don't know atmosphere lyrics, do you? You don't know atmosphere, do you? Do. Oh, fuck. Uh, hey. Just take the knee over, yeah. Um, so it's this thing. It takes place in the future, but the past? The future past. That's the way I used to always describe it to people. Like, in school, I'd be like, oh, I love Fallout. Like, What's Fallout? I'd be like, it's the future, but it's not. And they'd be like, what does that even mean? I'm like, yeah. And they're like, all right, thanks. I'm like, yeah, you got it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. Two kings. Two kings. Two fucking kings. Two <laughs> fucking kings over here. Oh, my. What's that, a 16? 16. I believe in it. 20. Let me get it, let me get it. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. 19. Oh, stay right there, big boy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. Feeling it. I'm feeling it now, Mr. Krabs. Oh, shit. Stay. I fucking love Blackjack. Okay, not great, but okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Future with the fit. Yeah. That's a 10. I'm going to double on that. Yes. Come on, let me get 400. Feel very lucky. I've told the story before, but I'll tell it again. I, uh, when the trailer for Fallout, Fallout 4 dropped, I was in a statistics class in high school. And, uh, this kid, I think his name was Walker. I don't even know why I remember this, but I never spoke to this dude. I never spoke to this dude ever. And he came up to me in the hall. Like, I'm sitting there in this class like this. We weren't allowed to have our phones, but I'm glued to my phone like this sitting there fucking watching it and uh i will make elijah pay and uh i'm sitting there glued to it and the teacher comes over and goes hey what's with the what's with that retro tune because it's the fucking uh what song is it it's is all over what's the fucking fallout the 4? intro yeah no the fallout 4 trailer the reveal trailer what was the it's all over but Let the crying yeah okay so it was that song and the teacher comes over, and he's like, hey, what's going on? And I didn't even answer him. And this is a man who I've known, like, my whole life. He was one of my best friends growing up's dad. And I walk in the hallway, and this kid comes up, and he goes, did you see it? And I went, it's fucking, like, I'm frothing at the mouth. I'm like, it's fucking happening. And I'm, like, shaking. And I went up to this kid, Takumi, and I shook him, and I was like, we're getting it finally. He's like, what are you talking about? And I was like, four out four. I was very excited about that. You break even. I'm almost there, so I'm. Um, I can. I can. I can stop whenever I want. We're almost as there. You, as you're like itching yourself. I can stop whenever I want. <laughs> I can stop whenever. I can stop whenever. This is. It's all good. It's all good. It's one all more. Good. You just need good. to win one more. Once you win one more, that's it. You're gonna walk away. Probably shouldn't have done that. I just lost more chips. All right. So now I need to make that back. Now it's all good. Don't worry. Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. All right. So we're at either seventeen 19. or a nine. I'm gonna double down on it. What? But you're at a nineteen. Or a nine. Yeah. I'm going to double down on them. Okay. Because they busted, probably. Uh, you just need one more, dude. Just one more. Just one more. Just one more. Nope. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Just one more. 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 What's that? 14? Double down? That's 21. You got it, dude. You're given a complimentary gift. Oh, you have a compliment to give waiting for you at the cashier, so I have to go pick it up. Yeah. It's probably like fucking. Who knows? Uh, it's probably like a bottle what are you of whiskey. Doing? What do you mean? What am I doing? You're doing it again? I could just, I just need a couple more and I'm done. Did you say needed a couple more? I just need a couple more and I'm done. That's it. And then I, thought, I have enough. I thought, I thought you didn't need to. I thought no, you could stop anytime you want. I can stop whenever I want, absolutely. But just I need to just play a couple more games for my own self edification. And then I'm done. And then I go walk away and I never have to play ever again. I have to pee right, really fast, awesome. so go I'm, I'm going to be pee. Right. I'm going to sit here and play a little more. I'm Dude. Gonna, I just got 21 right there. Chris. Dude, word. You Dude, know what? You don't mean? stop Don't stop until Dude. you've made at least 10,000 earnings. In the words of Michael Jackson, I will not stop till I get enough. Sounds good. So how are you guys feeling? How are you guys in chat feeling? This is, a, this is an 11 plus 1 right now. I'm going to double down on it for a 14 and lose. Um, but how are you guys feeling? What's new? What's going on in your life? When was the last time you called your mom? Uh, is she doing well? Uh, that's, I'm gonna lose another 400 chips right there. Okay, now we're not doing great again. Chris left, and my entire life kind of fell apart in front of me. Eight, nine, ten. 
I'm gonna stay there. Max win? Lanius is saying Max win. I think I'm on Lanius' side. Okay, that's an 18. I kinda gotta stay with an 18. I feel like I'm gonna lose, but I won. Okay, you know what? You know what they say? You know they they they, they you're always a you're always a winner until you've lost. Kill him up. Max win. Absolutely. Oh. Double down on an 11. Fuck yeah, 21. That's 400 chips right there. Damn, oh. what are you, the fucking, the quickest pisser in the West? Yeah, dude. God damn, dude, you should be proud of yourself. It's 19 right there. That's 400 chips left. The, the Legget. The Legget says we should do max, max win. I'm gonna, Wait, max? I'm, max win. Quickest pisser in the West. Quickest pisser in the West. Uh, I'm going to listen to the Legget. Because the Wait, what's Legget, max win? Like 10,000 10, Sierra Madre chips. I'm going to listen to the Legget for a couple different reasons. Because if I fail the Legget, he'll have, um, he'll kill 10% of my men using, right? How, 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 in my head it worked better. Forget it. He's going to... He's going <laughs> to... <laughs> uh, well, I just realized, though, so we're... Oh, good. We're only at an hour. Yeah. Okay. Because we do have to... We have a lot to do before we can get into the vault. So, just remember that. We've got a lot I mean, we've still got to do. I know what I'm doing, Chris. No, I can... I can, I can tell. Stop oh, this is watching. Yeah. <laughs> the son of Mars. 7,000 chips. We're so close. I can stop whenever I want. Uh, I can stop at any second. You broke anything. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, I could think of the lore, Papa. Thank you. Mm hmm. That's a regular hit. I'm gonna. Oh. I'm gonna stay right there. What is what does the radio man say? What is the fucking Mr. New Vegas? He says he ordered a tenth of the Legate's army. He ordered the tenth of one army to to kill the other percentage or to, to kill the commanding officer of a platoon in the in the the legion he said that 10 percent had to kill the commanding officer or something like that i forget exactly what it is <laughs> oh my god <laughs> damn <laughs> Dick, I'm... Dick, I'm... Oh, um, Nine decimation. Tenths. Yes. Yeah. I can hear him saying it. But, like, I can Kaisar? Can't, no, I can hear, like, he ordered the other nine-tenths. Really? Because I thought when I remembered hearing about that, it was from Kaisar describing it. I remember... I thought I remember... No, I remember Mr. New Vegas saying it. They probably both do. Come on, look how close we are. Did you get kicked out again? Yeah, I think there's one more. F5. Let's go! <laughs> That's a double Fuck them up! There. Fuck them up! I Fuck wish them I up! I wish I knew what that was from. Somebody said it yesterday in chat, but I genuinely don't remember. Fuck. Lost 200. Okay, that's not, that's not great. It's not great. It's not great. That's a double down right there. Woo! What's your favorite Gucci Mane mixtape? I know you don't have one. I'm fucking with you. I was just about <laughs> to say, I'm like, really, dude? <laughs> What's a Gucci Mane mixtape? Sometimes I think about Gucci Mane. And I think about, like, how he used to make great music. Dude, lemonade? Oh my god, dude. We used to bump lemonade so fucking loud. Lemonade, cut. Oh my god. Double down on that. I'm about to get kicked out. This next one will kick me out. Ha! Get fucked. Maybe not. Kick me out. You have reached the jackpot limit, but feel free to explore explore the Madre. Cool. That's funny. Yep. Wow. You have been, you have been banned. 
Dude, if you do too well at a casino, they break your fucking legs. That's awesome. So, do I redeem it? Free chips? Where'd you see free chips? Right there. I thought, you meant like, I thought you meant, like, fucking potato chips. Yeah, I no, was ready I know, to party. I know, I know. You are probably really excited. The soldiers line up, and every ten soldiers steps forward, and nine before them kill him. Jesus yeah. Jesus Christ. Yeah, that's, that's Decamito, or whatever. Like, it re translates, I think, to, like, decimation or something like that. Oh, cool. Let me go to the vendor quick. Vendor quick? Vendor quick. Hello, my name is Vendor quick. <laughs> the holographic gash your face is you flickering. It seems to be waiting for you to speak. Can I turn in my CR Madre chips? Nazin. So I got a bottle of scotch. Bottle wine. of wine. That's it? Pre-war park stroller outfit. Huh. Pre-war hat. Huh. And this will probably be the last one. Steam trailing from it? What happened? What the fuck happened? What did I get? Does anybody know what just happened? Yeah, I, I don't certainly know. It don't. didn't, like, say. Uh. Uh. Weapons? Can you Google what the top comp prize is in the Madre? I thought I actually saw on the side it said, like, just park stroller and, like, pre-war hat or something like that. Either way, I'm going to buy every fuck... Look at this. Watch this. You ready for this? How much are stim packs? Pre-war park stroller outfit and hat. That's it. Wait. Okay. Let me see. Because, see? Huh. Yeah. The Vicky Advance gives you a fucking stealth boy. These are the I That's have nice. I have eleven thousand chips. Yep. They're twenty five caps. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so you could, but I'm telling you, I mean, I would be smart about this, you know, because like I can't buy a stealth boy though. No, I wish you could. If you could, this would be all be so much. Be easier. smart about it. Well, I mean, like you're not gonna. Are you gonna spend all of the? I, you can only buy a hundred at a time, anyways. Uh, yeah. You're gonna spend all of it on stim packs. What else am I gonna buy? I could buy ammo. That's the only other thing that's gonna do me any good. Or you could just like hold on to it and like, also, can't you wait? Can't you give him the the cashier guy chips for pre-war money? Yeah, why would I do that? Well, I was gonna say for money's sake, but I guess it wouldn't matter if we have all the. I, I all honestly, the gold bars. I'd much rather have. Well, yeah, I'm gonna get all the gold bars, but I'd much rather be able to not die constantly. I mean, this is basically going to be like invincibility. But I did it like through the means of the game. Like, no, I yes, absolutely. So no, I yeah. So this is, I mean, this is nice what you're doing. Yeah, like, that's awesome. Cool. Now you've got... Can I buy more? Nope. You are... You're stimped I out. I have five chips on tight. Cool. I'm like really. This is gonna be crazy to see how many stim packs you have. I think I have like under 400. You have 536. Oh, wow, great! I'm never gonna die, dude. Yeah. I'm unstoppable. I'm untouchable. Here, I'm look at you. Look at you right now. You've got a little bit. You could use a little bit of health. Yeah, Why not? Dude, I'll, Why not? You know what, dude? I you know have what? So many. Look at this. You know what? Look at this. One, I light my. I light two. my cigarettes with stim packs. You know, I have an ottoman just made out of stim packs. That I kick my feet up. Woken up Shut the fuck up, Eliza. Whoa, I'm talking. On, no, I'm kidding. Oh, that's not nice. <laughs> Looks like they got moved to other floors. Okay, let's get it. Going to be a casino bird. No more being. Hurry up and deal with the FEV reject. He's of no use to us. So now I can kill people. Yes. That's so silly. You had to you had to shut off the security. Oh, you're right. It's just that right after we shut off the security, we were like... Is that what I think it is? That is a key. All right, guys. So we're done gambling. For now. Uh-oh. Okay, I thought that was... Protect you. 
the reason I have to Must keep be a back control is... The kitchen. Check the main casino side corridors. Find it. What? Must be a back entrance to the kitchen. It's Remember that door that said it was hermetically sealed? Go to that one. Go to that door, yeah. Okay. Now I think I think you can get into it now. I read you can find vouchers in the BOS bunker. Ooh. Yeah, I think you this actually way? Yeah, I think you actually get vouchers like every once in a while. And you could just go back to the bunker and redeem yep. them? That's you get them through the mailbox. Awesome. I the really little, like drop I don't know why I genuinely thought you were like, yeah, you get it in the mail. I was like, yeah, dude, fuck yeah. No, it's like, well yeah. yeah. The mail? Yo, let's talk about the US Postal Service. This is now a stan account for the U.S. Postal Service. I and love the. It's, the it's amazing that it works. A single spark, right. or he sets off his collar. The casino's going to burn. Us along with him. Shut off the gas oh, valve so that if he sees you all. while you're doing this, you, 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 you everything. You I can't talk to him. You have to shut off the gas first. There's one shot. back there, left. Yeah, that one. Yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, pair is high enough, right? Yeah. Uh. Do this. We both Papa, what do you mean? Don't get you started. Dog wants to die. Don't care anymore. Tired of you. Tired of play. All uh. fire now. Burn away. No. Dog. Oh, that's it. You died. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> We're gonna steal these fucking gold bars. Sorry, I just had a gamble like a fucking addict. I have no control. You know what step one is? Dominion of rum. Surrender. Is that not what I did by saying I had a problem? Well, yeah, but it's more than that. Haha! Haha! Spawns every three days in the bunker, so have fun never needing to buy health items ever again. Wow. Wait, really? Wow! Holy shit! Thank you, Kyle. Thank you, Papa. Help us. Please. I will. Be so be here. aware of where he is and just sneak around, find the things. And there's so many things coming here on Wednesday. I have two packages already coming here Wednesday. Wow. Yeah. Wednesday gonna be busy day. Uh oh. He saw you. Really? Yeah. <sighs> okay, one more time. One more time from the top. Chris, could you serenade us with a tune, please? Absolutely. I'm going to play the fucking theme song. You ready? Yeah. You ready? Uh, I'm, yes. One, two, one, two, three, four. NCR Chuck, we don't have Boone, but we're going to kill Elijah really soon. No Rex the dog or any of the I bop, but the glitches never end. It's NCR Chuck. So, okay, at the risk of dying right here, why can't I fucking... I'm hidden. Am I not hidden? Right now you're hidden. Because of the door, I think, being open. His line of sight was... The reason I... Thanks, Papa. Oh, yeah, thank you. Yeah, that was probably a big reason that was happening. Um, did you? He saw me. Fire now. Burn. Die. Dog wants to die. It's so, like hearing that is so sad. He saw me. Fire now. He saw me. Die. Dog wants to die. Don't care anymore. Tired of you. Tired. Die. Dog wants to die. Don't care. I think he's, he's walked past that. You could go through that doorway now, I think. Master will help us. Yeah. Please let's He's, he's down there, so. If you don't go to your room. Going to make casino burn. No more beer. Sorry, I didn't mean to shush you like that. Stop what you're doing. Go left. That's the other valve. Now the va the room he's in right now that he just walked into, that's where the last valve is. So you sure. Pretty sure. Also, look at your map. Your map will tell you. Oh, really? Local map? Yeah. Is he the icon? Oh, I, no, is I in meant like room. if I opened the thing. No, like just, that. Right yeah. there. Careful, he's gonna probably walk out. Tired of place. 
through there. Look at me looking, like stretching my neck yeah. and it's gonna do something. Please help us. If you don't, then you're going to make a zero. Where the fuck is he? He's in the room you have to get into, unfortunately. It's in there. Wow. Fuck, he saw you. Are you fucking kidding me? Is he the most perceptive super mutant on the block? What the fuck? I have a gun that, like, doesn't fucking do anything. Fuck, he's literally looking at the last one, I think. It's there. Oh, it, okay. He's, like, glitched out and will not move. Yeah, I can see that. It's like a bad acid trip. Wow. No. Wow, wow, wow. Back in the cage. Stop what you're doing. Dog. I mean, <laughs> see how he's like fucked up? Yeah. Come on, dog. This is not poggers, dude. This is Am I dying? Yes, the, the gas slowly takes away health. What the fuck are we... Where? What? Who? Okay, this is part of one cell. Um, I'm confused. <laughs> Blows up in no clip. I have no fucking clue where I am. That's that way. That what way, fucking that way, way did that I come way. from? Okay, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna hit this button. Yeah. So I... Oh, I think now he moved. Okay. Oh, fuck. Does this make it so that they can't see you either? No. Oh, shit. I can still interact with the environment as long as I play. What the fuck? That's wild. Okay, we can't do that anymore. Oh no, 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 no. Help us. Please let me help us. If you don't, then you're going to make a zero burn. No more being back in the cage. Stop what you're doing. We can get you. You think he comes this way? Not much. Maybe. But I, Listening it seems like me. he's glitched in there. You know what Tired I mean? Of being your minder. Whoa, is he, is he coming out through the doorway? Right behind you? Yep, there he is. You can go around now if he moves. Well, he's got to go that way. Yeah. Hold on. Oh, dog, you're killing me, dude. It's almost like every time you look at him, he glitches. Uh, let me see if I can occlusion call him. He's like a weeping angel, Kyle. <laughs> if you right, look at him, this. just don't blink. That's a doctor. Who's yeah. Blink? Yeah. For the weeping angels. I was gonna say if he just saw me, I'd be pissed. Fuck pissed. This is the most like this is worse than watching somebody gamble. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe, I, I, I don't know if it's going to work, if you have nothing else. Maybe you can just run in there quick, just do the, undo the valve before. All th Repair the valve. It might not work, though. I don't know. Fire now. Burn away. F no. You? Master. No. Not master. Dog remembers you. Kind to dog. Dog can't do this. Yes, he can. You caused this. Coddled him. Protected him. Now I'm going to have to take control from you. You need to go. Run. Could you start Dog the sauce? Going to burn, boys. Wait, burn the ham? Boys. The ham! Burn it the away. ham! Take care of the ham, please. The ham! 
the ham. Dog, if you do this, you're going to kill yourself. If you try to burn the voices out of you, the casino will be destroyed, killing us along with us. You can't do this, you're going to kill yourself. I think Chuck Dog is saying. tired of voice inside. Tired so of sad. being in another cage again. Try to kill this human dog. Kill them. If this casino is destroyed, good. It'll kill the old man, too. The one who shouts at dog. The Dude, voice the ham ran away. What? Yeah. Stop the voice. How many stars did you get? Of like 10 or okay. Like a lot. Dog, the voice doesn't control you. You're not leaving me any choice. I'll have to stop you. Fine, reject. That's so awful. Dog tried to shut it out. Tried to hurt self enough to make it. Fun fact, that's what? probably the hardest thing for me to roleplay in a Fallout game this. is a character who hates all mutants, all ghouls, you know what I mean? Basically a, a, a racist character. Mm. That's like the hardest thing for any- You don't have to do this, listen to me, my voice. Dog, dog wants to, dog does, but it's time for you to realize who's in control here. Ooh, First, shit. we tear you apart. Then this casino and the Damn. old man. I've never it. killed dog before. And he's dumb fucking strong, man. Uh, I wonder what he's hit. Oh. Help. To kind to dog. Then hurt dog. You hate dog. Hate him what? just as I do. Do you understand now? Do what you understand fuck? why I have to take control? He why keep hurting self? Voice keeps telling dog to do things. Dog just wants voice to go away. Away. It's so gut-wrenching not being able to help him. I don't mean you any harm. You just need to calm down and focus. Dog tried. Just hard. Hard to hear over voice sometimes. <laughs> He's strong as a man with 500 now. plus stim packs. Pain. Pain. Aww. It won't shut me out, dog. It won't silence me. This human. Both of them. They mean to help dog, please. Oh Please. my god. Look, listen to my voice. Maybe I can help. No. Dog is my creature. And he's more than enough to end you here and now. Oh, dude. Not... Fucking killing me. Now you have to run. Why? Get out. Before, your before your collar explodes. Maintenance pass. Try to take it. Just take it. Just. Before your collar blows. Get out of there. Fuck. Okay. The right. Hold on. Oh, okay. Wait. What are we doing here? Oh. Fuck. 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 You've got one of the floors reestablished. Good. Careful, there's Accessing the music ghosts. archives now. Two more to go. Oh. It seems the casino has unwanted guests. He's the my friend. And I even doing at the it. doors. Now they found a way inside. He's Deal with them. And don't try and leave yourself, or I'll let the collar do its work. Wow, he's my favorite, dude. Hmm? Dog's my favorite. Yeah. So I gotta go up here now? Yeah, I think the next theater. is the theater. Uh, so it's Dean Domini. Yeah, Dean Domini. The theater! The theater! What's happened to the theater? It's from a movie. Mm -hmm. White Christmas, if anybody knows it, I don't know. Never seen it. Is that ghoul still alive? Correct. Correct. I bet he thought so. Those people are gonna follow you through that door. I'm scared. Good. Let him fuck him. Good! <laughs> no! Oh, yeah. Oh. 
Oh yeah. It's just a little to the left. Nope. Nope. Oh yeah. Boom. I can't remember how to get done, like, get through this and not killing him. Oh, that was the radio. Where? To your left, up there. I'm gonna fucking die again. Where was it? I didn't see it. When you go through the- as soon as you go through the doorway, up and to the right. Oh, I have to shoot it? Yes. Okay. And, but I think the rest of the ones that are in the theater are shielded. You can't break them. This that's the tricky one about this one is the fucking radios. That's valid, Papa. Alive. Correct. What did you say? I'm sorry. It's just up into the right. But the rest of the radios are shielded, I think. Get out of there. Back up, yeah. They're all shielded. What you have to do is you have to get to the center of the room. What? That's where the shield, the speakers are all far enough away from you that they won't hit right you. Right here? Yes. And then, I would save before taking the part. Okay. You. What? He said something, but I didn't hear him. It's supposed to open dialogue with him. What's going on? What the fuck? Okay, this is really weird. There was supposed to be dialogue between you two, and then he unleashes security, but like... That one I can't destroy, right? Yeah, correct. I think you're gonna explode. It happens. Chris, we get a song, please? What? Can we get a song going? Please. He's like, nah, 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 partner. Stage, take a powder. The audience is a little murderous tonight. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This this is different. The last time I've done this, the last time I did this, he did not talk to me like that. You know what I bet it is? It's because you got the um the holograms to guard him when he was there. I bet that's the difference. I bet that's how you find a way to somehow do what, this. What do you think I should say to him? I don't. I, I, uh, how did you get here from the gal? How did you get from the gal? Ha ha yeah, how did you get from the gal in here? I was already halfway off the rooftop, through the service tunnel, and making a break for the gate before the light show started, and before Vera finished her gala speech. I knew what had happened with music in the streets and lights in the sky, ghost people, lots of them. Also meant the front gate was open, and no way was I missing it after all these years. Then. I walk in, and... What? How'd you get up there? No idea. Woke up here, thought I was dreaming for a second. Right back on the stage, the mic. Thought I was back at the Fronds. Always. <laughs> Except no audience used to pack theaters back then. So, stepped up on the stage, checked things out. Then suddenly, holograms walked out of the wings. They started raising their hands to their heads, all creepy-like. Not a good sign. Wait, what holograms? What are you talking about? Look, those ghosts are going to come out of the wings behind you in a second. The security types, not the friendly, bald types. And if you got in here, the door's probably locked. Nobody who's bald is friendly. You, so no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> or run for the exit. The fuck You're did you say? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Trust me, as soon as you can, run to the door to the left. 
No. Use the key you got out of the music rag there and camp out. His left, as bad not as your are, left. It's going to get a lot stage worse left. Either of us pops. Yes. So get backstage. What the fuck? That's genius. Wait. A better plan. Yeah. Yeah. Wait. Intelligence six. I need to head to the door on your left or my left. Yeah. What? Oh, uh, my left. Your right. So, so that yeah. that way. Run to yes. The door on your right. <laughs> Almost got you killed there. Us killed there. Repair. Dean, the theater speakers are wired to a central sound system, right? Yeah. Y yeah. So what? We got bigger problems with the holograms. No. Uh, no. Wait. You're right. The theater piped music and sound backstage, which means those little squealers are in the corridors back there. You know what I just noticed? He doesn't have a ghoul voice. Yeah. I have a theory as to why. Why? So he was a singer, right? So over these years, he's like done whatever he can to make sure his vocal cords like stay as healthy as possible. Because he's a singer. You think I should calm down one problem at a time? Or good thing you mentioned that before I ran back there, partner. Throw it back at him. Yeah. I kind of like that. So basically what he's saying. Look, I'm in danger here, all right? Not exactly thinking with a level head, so cut me some slack. Please. Uh, let's see. Um, once you break right, watch each turn in the corridor. One will be on your right, past my dressing room, and up. Oh, uh, my dressing room. May have left the radio on, right by the table. Uh, if you could just shut it off instead of blowing it up. Uh, never mind. <laughs> and there was a speaker in the prop room, too, on the wall between the entrances. Okay. What about a central sound system? This one? Yeah. The speakers are all controlled by a central console. It's the farthest from the only door out of here, so you'd need to do a full circuit of the corridor to get to it. Once there, you'll need to shut it down, and I don't have the code. If you have the code, you can turn off That's what I'm all saying, the speakers, Papa. make them settle down. Getting backstage should buy us time. Just take it slow. Maybe. This casino security piss was pissing me off. Yeah. You are preaching to the choir. Sinclair and his security don't even get me started. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Him being pissed about the security. Just he's pissed about the security because he's been trying to break into this to fucking for vault years. for years. Yeah. Changing color and raising their hands. Not a good sign. All right, run. Run to the right. All right, hold on. I to go, 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 go. Right here, right? Yes, right through there. Go, go, go. <laughs> Close the door. Close the door! The cloud's back. Yeah, just right by that door for some reason, if you go by it. And here, there's radio right there. Oh, what the fuck? It's still going, get the fuck out of there. Oh, fuck me. You were so close. Bah, bah. Is it? I don't know, I don't think it is. I'm dead in this eye long. Normally no, he, you scrolled up. You scrolled up. Oh. Yeah. Oh, no. I'm so turned around. Close the door. It's probably because there's another one on the wall. So I would go and deactivate that, then run out of there. Oh. Right, on the behind you now. Yeah. There what was the another fuck? one. Oh, That's really? why I was surprised. I'm like, why is he waiting? Oh, there could be damn. another one. I'm like, I thought that was gonna be fucking like. <laughs> Look at me! I did just in the right turn. <laughs> Who dies? Bond shit. That's the thing, dude. This fucking. You know what this DLC is? What's that? Like a good word to describe it, this DLC 
is humbling. Okay. It fucking puts you in your place. Yeah. That's why I like it. Yeah. Because it me makes too. you realize that fucking you have no control. You are at the mercy of everybody else. I have Vera's key now. I want to get the dress. I want to give it to Veronica. Where's hey, the other one? A dress. Look around. It's that one on the wall. Hopefully. More you cloud. Know, I do. I, let me just check something quick. Beep, beep, beep. You could get two now. You're still doing it. You're still. Yeah. I, I, you know what you could do, honestly. That's like kind of smart. I mean, give it to the the followers. Well, I was gonna say is yeah, you could sell you can sell your stim packs. Like, you're pr honestly probably gonna have enough that you can fucking literally sell them. She mm radio. -hmm. Hopefully that's the only thing. Nope. Fuck. I bet it's a thing on a wall too. Look at me. Where the fuck? Hey, Good. Uh, look, that's Peter's room. So no. Can I not turn this off? Nope. Yeah, I'm gonna die. I'm done. You have to get to that terminal that's right around the corner. Oh, really? Yeah, get to that terminal right there. Ambient audio control. Power, Power off ambient audio. Yeah! Now we're good! Now I can look around Vera's room. There's no dress, though. Oh, really? Nope, that's in her room. <laughs> Robert Gotta go Pins. to her room. Pre-war bonnet. Was it? Yeah. I just see pre-war and like don't think because it was like okay, I don't, I don't need it. Huh? No medics. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's horrible. What if? Ooh, Ooh. meeting people. Yeah. I wish I was a magazine reader. A reader of magazines? Yeah. Why? Wait, is the security gone? Nope. Why did you oh, do that? Oh, fuck. So what do I gotta do? Uh, oh, I know what you gotta do. You gotta go back. Remember there were stairs up, there were stairs that went up uh -huh. to like, yeah, you gotta go up there now. But that's the this door. What? That's this door here. No, I mean you have to go around. Yeah, follow, go down that corridor thing. And while hugging the left-hand wall exiting through there, um, there's stairs that go up to the booth. Right around where that guy, unfortunately, is. That, yeah, yeah, this. Gotta go to the top. The booth. You gotta go to the top, then you gotta go through there, and then you gotta play uh, Dean's song. Play Dean's song. Okay. Play Dean's? Yeah. Sorry. sorry. Wow, shut the fuck up, Dean Domino. I hate him so much. What do you mean it took oh, too those long? Those electric ghosts aren't the kind of audience I like at the what best you mean, Papa? times. At least the ones in the filler had... Oh, to so, like, I guess he means, like, for letting the song play out. Yeah. Oh, 
guess the casino still recognizes guests, even after all this time. Yeah, lucky us. Love getting a shot at, love getting shot at by pre-war ghosts. Look, I'm more about the short goodbyes than long, thankful speeches. But I appreciate you bailing me out of a tight spot there, partner. I know you didn't do it out of the goodness of your heart. So let me give you something a little more practical. A way we both come out like of it. I know. What do you mean? What do you mean? I'm not an idiot. I know the reason I'm in here now is because of the old guy. And you. And you. And you're wearing a collar, so I trust you a little more than the old guy. He's more controlling than I'd like. Thing is, here's where being my partner pays off. See, I know how to get into the casino vault. What do you mean? There's a private elevator, Sinclair's elevator. It's up in the executive suites in Vera's room. Not a coincidence. Vera. She was my other partner before the bomb. Took some legwork. Some convincing made it happen. Oh, so. so Sinclair was already puppy-eyed, so all I had to do was the introductions. She smiled, fluttered her eyes, Show showed a little me. leg, and he built this whole place for her. Made her the key to his vault, like a joke, because of her name. Her fake Hollywood Except Sinclair didn't know I'd been there first. I could twist her whatever direction I <laughs> Taking advantage of women is wrong. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> All she had to do was get inside the Sierra Madre it's so for the horrible, gala. Though. Yeah. And use her voice to open the door. He's a selfish fuck. Yeah. After that, smooth sailing. Would have been the biggest heist, heist in history. history. Sinclair left holding the bag. Ruined. So what happened? Yo! Vera got sealed in here. That would actually be sick. A few hundred years go by, give or take. Almost the end of the story. That would be really fucking then cool. You came along. Now we finish the job. Rob the Sierra Madre, rip out its heart. Last chapter of Frederick Sinclair. Close the book. What's his fucking problem with. I was literally just about to say, Trouble? what's his fucking. All high and mighty, lording it over everyone, acting, acting so, so self righteous. You're mad that like his dick was bigger than yours. He was the one with the problem. Never got mad at anything, nothing seemed to shake him. Even after his life kept getting dragged. That through is dirt. annoying. Always kept looking what? for Over the bright, the shining people. future and everything. So, I decided to take everything from I mean, I don't agree with Dean. But yeah. what did he do to you? Do to me? What, weren't you listening? He thought he was better than me. Don't believe me? Like, look around. He's so this selfish. Big yeah. Casino. This big casino. He built this casino to say he's got a bigger dick than me and I don't appreciate it. No. All ego. Yeah, him and his All ego. Yeah. And lights fit him perfect. Had to take him down a few pegs. Bring him down to my level. So you're saying he was better than Begin you. Begin again. Some things you don't get up from. I was going to prove it. So you're going to prove it now? How? I didn't know at first. Then the old man showed up. You showed up. 
Then that woman shall That's one evil wall. Yeah. Scar. The one who makes all the hand signs a little tight around the corners of her mouth. I put her in the clinic, tuned her like an instrument. If she heals up, it's not going to be her voice speaking anymore. That is, if the Sierra Madre didn't get her. I hate this son of a if bitch. If it did, well, there's enough of Vera around for me to spend a few years piecing a book together. And if she's alive? Then she can make some beautiful music. I'm not banking on it. So here's the short of it. Piece together Little Miss Vera Key's song in the right order. Sierra Madre opens its legs within business. The Desert Mother. All right, well, I don't see what I can do on my end. Go, knock yourself out. I'm just going to catch my breath a bit. That performance, well, more pressure than I was expecting. What do you want to do with him? I don't know. Are you going to let him live? I don't know. I fucking hate him so much. You want to just max out guns in melee? Uh. I guess. We don't have to. Well, we don't have enough to max out both of them in one shot, but. We can max out one. Um, nah, let's keep it even. Yeah, bring it to 75. Three left. Uh, put that in a. Uh, honestly, I kind of think unarmed. I know. It's up to you, man. I mean, going to be performing here I just... For sure. this place is like, I don't even... I mean, like, for Chuck, I mean, I don't know how... How would Chuck feel about Dean Domino? You know? I think we should ask chat. Yeah, I would... I, I'll be straight up. I recognize my own bias with what to do with Dean Domino, so I'm, like, not gonna Chad, make any decisions. I don't think Chuck is very much of a... Not a murderer. That's the. I agree like, too. Like I mean, yeah. Don't like, get me wrong. He, he does the things for. And he murdered. Right, but he, he does for like for him to kill. There needs to be justice in it. Yeah. And I don't know. Maybe he'd think Dean's a scumbag for what he did, but does he deserve to die? Another fragment. Good. Almost have the entirety of what I need from the music archives. Uh -oh. Once you have the last fragment, you can thread the archives together. With the That's fucking. I love that. There. Yeah. Fuck the pop. This one's like tall. I love the bear trap fist. I just I think it's such an interesting weapon, and it's actually not that bad when you have like an arm, really? an high on arm skill. Using it, that's that's last time I did a Sierra Madre, that's all that's what my character was using because she was an unarmed build. I thought I was gonna throw me right in the dialogue. Find the mute and deal with her. She's somewhere on this floor. Floor is buzzing with emitter signatures. Watch out for holograms. This is who I think it is. This is Christine. Recovered. In what looks like an old world hotel room. Class. I'm not sure Two maybe rooms. he would Hold on a second. exit sealed. Learning all doors what are locked down. Is that Laura Bailey? And emitter signals are lighting up all over this floor. I'll do what I can from here. Laura's got holographic security. Not the latest tech. We all pay Build for a what few we've targeting done. systems. I'm so sorry, primitive. Sinclair. Sorry. Familiar. Fuck. Hold on. Should shit. be able to Is rewire them. To Failing that? No. Shoot them. No. Although, that'll alert the others. They're on a linked patrol pattern. The floor looks like it protected the guests too well. Check the suite. Found the holographic woman from the Villa Fountain. Picking up that interference frequency, same as the Villa. I've never the heard this before. You hear Vera, like, Keep calling out? Watch the walls. Oh, Doors on this floor are all operated manually in an emergency. Place is locked up tight. Must be key cards around somewhere. Looks like security systems did more to kill the people here than the bomb did. There's a way out of this casino. 
we all pay for Papa what says he's done. not sure. He thinks. I'm so sorry, Sinclair. He thinks sorry, uh, maybe he would learning about what he did to her. You. Maybe he would kill her. Kill uh, Dean, knowing what he did to. Her. That's the thing. Like, I don't know. For me, like, where did you go? what did he you did was here? fucked up. Mm-hmm. Straight up. Sinclair. Sinclair. What am I doing? You have to find a way to get to Christine. She's like through this maze of hallways and shit. I think. To be let out, to let go. This door doesn't work. I think you have to go in there and then go right without getting caught and killed. But yeah. There you go. Probably a radio in here. So. I feel like there's something in here to repair that's like really good. That like really helps. I ain't no goddamn friend. Oh, there's a key on the table. Override emergency door seal. We've been reading over this. Oh, I've read this already. Almost at the end, dude. Yeah, I know. I want to get these fucking gold bars to get out of here. As much as I love this DLC. You know what I mean? No, yeah. It it drags it out of you, and it's like, yeah. it's meant to. And, like, it's a weird... It's honestly, like, a weird, um... Fixing thing. Like, pain that I literally look forward to when I play this game is this feeling of, like, I need to get the fuck out. Like... Okay, so back out. Work on Magus Farmer no more. Sorry, I. That was so funny when that place had a listing for a job. And you're like, yo. And, you're, and I was like, yeah. no, no. <laughs> Claire, where did you go? I'm looking to make some quick money. You said what? <laughs> go back through that door you came in. Since you were something good over here. By the pins. Robert Penn. Through there, and then is can you go in there? Damn! Oh yeah, no. Fuck. Do you have to turn the gas off first? There's probably a gas valve somewhere. I ain't no gosh damn son of a bitch. Let's take a bite of it, baby. So I think that Let's um, just do this one. Okay. Good. Papa, if you're watching. You're better at this than I. Roaming smashed meaning. So I would start off with roaming because it has an ing at the end. So it doesn't have an ing at the end. Otherwise, it would have three in common. So. So it's R O A M. R O A M. No, not necessarily. No, no. But I'm saying it's not ing. So it could be an R O A M. Well, it could also be if they're smashed. Okay. I was wrong. Mean it, no. Cousins, no. Reasons. Resides, reasons. It could be heavily. Wait. It was heavily. I think it might be reasons. All right, dude. No, it wouldn't be reasons. Raisins? A variety of raisins! What do you think? It could actually technically be reasons because... What the fuck? Fuck. You, we're gonna have to back out. Come on. Or, yeah, do those. We might get our allowances replenished. I'm um, looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Oh, right down there, bottom right. There's Cedos too. Yeah. Sick. So, what'd you say? Heavy? Reasons. Reasons is three. It's not that one, because that one has four in common. Reasons. 
Reasons, reasons. Some sort of ra- You did a really good- A variety of raisins. That wasn't bad. Of Mobius? Yeah. I just got done Sailant? with it myself. Oh, nice. Wow, I just said fuck it. Table hallway loudspeakers. Download this. Sure, download- Superheated knife! Yes! Hey. Cosmic piece of shit knife, pilot light, hot plate. Tight. That's why he literally says cosmic piece of shit. I thought, yeah. I thought that was something you said. Pilot light and a hot plate. So I need a pilot light. Watch, there's not going to be one in here. You know what it does, right? What? Every time I go to slash at somebody, it, it has a chance to catch them on fire. With the cosmic knife. Nice. What do I need? I've already forgotten what I need. Hot plate and what else? Uh, it's in an oven. Oh, pilot light. Um. No. No. I don't see it. No. Did I ever tell you that Olive spoke to Ian Zer on Twitter? Who? who? The guy who. There it the is. Where'd you Above see it? the Wonder Glue. That's the pilot lights. Tight. How do I make it? Uh, go to the thing. Here? Yeah. Cosmic knife superheated. Tight. Yeah, it's like a rare weapon that you can make now. I like the superheated Saturn knife fist. Check this out. It glows. Sick. Alright. F5. I thought I turned that off. No. Go back, maybe. I should have Fuck. trusted you. No. Oh, through there. It's a clock. Oh, never, never mind. Oh, there's not. Again, Claire, this fucking did you go? shit. Why did you, you know, leave me here? You know, it's funny, I think I literally remember this part, and I remember that I can't Shut find the radio. Fuck, I'm gonna die. That was like one beep away. Yeah. What the fuck do I do? What is in here? Why is this locked then? I need a fucking mouse pad. No, nah, there it has to be in there. That's and it has to be why I I have access to this. Alrighty. I'm so sorry, Sinclair. We're not playing uh, Among Us, Papa. Come on. It's a shitty game. Come on. Police pistol. Fuck 12, but police pistol's on me. Police pistol is like one of my favorite weapons in the game. Really? Because it's just. 0.357 Magnum is like the most easy to find ammo, I think. And especially at the end of this DLC, you get like 10,000 rounds of it. Why? So, like. Um. There it is. Why did you leave me here? Wait, what are you doing? Why? Sinclair! Sinclair! The door is I'm sealed. I... Oh my god. I can hear the other guests screaming to be let out. Is she, she's in here, right? Yeah, one to the left. Here. Okay. One over here. The quick scribe jumped over the lazy paladin. Quick scribe jumped over the lazy paladin. Is that what she said? Yeah. 
She's practicing her speech because it's a struggle for her. I can sleep here. Yes. I wonder if the quick scribe jumped over the lazy paladin is is every um steam voice of the brotherhood. Is every uh, letter in the English alphabet. What the fuck? Metal helmet. You're gonna die. Why is that here? Are you gonna like tear it off the radio? Or do you have? I don't even fun? know where it is. It's right on the book, the dresser, right next to the bed. Oh fuck! I didn't see it there. Perception is not my skill, Chris. That's okay. What, 549 <sighs> fucking stim packs? Dude, I'm untouchable. God, man, it's like booze. There you go, see? Oh, that's interesting. I never do that. Oh, big book of science? Oh, but you don't use... Oh, well, I guess you kind of use science, but not really. Uh... You made it. Good. To talk. I'll keep this quick in case my voice goes out. Sound like the woman in the, in the broadcast. Do I? Sounds off to my ears. Hard to tell. Not to mention it, it hurts like hell to swallow. Might be why I got moved off to this suite. It's hers. That's her over there. Got trapped by security like I did. Just took a different way out. Just glad you're safe. Hold here and I'll take care of Elijah. Eh. Now that your voice is back, what do you want to say? I've been hunting the one who hijacked your pit boy, Elijah, for some time. He cannot leave the Sierra Madre alive. What he's done? What he's done here is nothing compared to what he's done in the past. The only way to bring him out is if you get to the vault. He won't allow you to go down there alone. That's when we kill him. How long have you been hunting him? Too long. Thought I might have had a chance to settle it before this event happened. But then the chance slipped away again. Settle it? You're here to kill him? Those are my orders. I've seen what he's done, and I believe in those orders. Sounds personal. This... This time... It's personal. Yeah! <laughs> Cut me off from someone I cared about a long time ago. He used his status to break us apart. So I had to find a new purpose. Same banner. Then he became unstable. Left a trail of crimes across the wasteland. Once word reached us, I was ordered to kill him. Sorry, I wanted to make it a little louder for both me and the stream. Gotcha. He said he knew you. Okay. He saw me before the scars at a place far from here. It's where he found some of the technology he uses now. We know it's where a that place is. called the Big Empty. Oh, okay. The name's deceptive. If Where'd you, you know think? where to look? No, that's what I was gonna oh, say, okay, but right, I didn't right, think yeah. she would say it. There was someone else though who came along. Knew about Elijah. He knew Elijah? How? No idea. A courier. Wore an old world flag on his back. He was the one who pulled me out there. Told me where Elijah had gone. Helped me heal up. Listen to my story. Sympathized. Sympathized. He said he understood what it meant to track someone who had such a... Impact on his past life. He said people were like couriers, sometimes never understanding the messages they brought. That's who he was hunting for. Some courier. Hmm. 
You could have said something sooner. Wasn't sure until now I could trust you. Now I know. Just fuck it. Look, when I woke up here, however that happened, I had this key on me. I think it belongs to her. Haven't had a chance to use it yet. Might open the dresser or the safe. Didn't have time to experiment with it before you arrived. You hear that? Here you go. That's metallic monks. How did you get him the gala then? And onto this floor. The gala went off. The switching gala station or gala? opened up. Oh, some pe people say gala, some bad. people say gala. I would think for a gala, it would be G-A-Y-L-A. Right, that's what I would say. G-A-I-L-A. Yeah, I, I read that as gala. Also, me too. It seemed like the lights and speakers were helping to guide me. I'm pretty sure this is Laura your Bailey. master wanted a backup in case you died. As for being assigned to this floor, maybe it's because of my new voice. Your guess is as good as mine. Maybe it recognized me as a guest. There's is a chance. Is? is there? There's a chance we'll see reason. Do, do you think that Chuck would even want to try to reason with Elijah? I'm not gonna lie. I kind of feel sure like. Sure. Until now, I could trust you. Now I know. I slipped. Does that old dog really work? Yeah, it's still functional. A lot of garbage data on it. Its basic procedures <laughs> should still work fine. You know what I'm thinking is kind of interesting in this interaction, I can though. See, mm. a lot of medics was she's brotherhood. For Vera Keys. She said she's brotherhood. No, she didn't. Her corpse there for certain. You heard her say this is Christine Roy's brotherhood. Oh, uh, I guess. So yeah. She was ordered to hunt like down Elijah by her superiors. We know she's brotherhood. Condition. Diagnosis isn't conclusive. But she has the same conviction we do. I'm she not even hates sure this she guy. Knew if these she sees the evil in this guy. Not. We have a common she enemy. Must have been numb mm. most of the time. Just glad you're safe. Oh, dog. That's sure. sad. No. Yeah. They run a lot deeper than that. While I was hunting Elijah in the Big Empty, he trapped me in one of those medical research centers buried there. It did something to my head, and I got off lucky. It's difficult enough to read now, and somehow the leap between what's in my head and words, it just ends up being a mishmash of symbols, not letters. I can still do math, formulas, equations, Writing poetries out. You said you got off lucky. Yeah, I saw records of other patients and what had been done to them. Yeah. Some couldn't hear anything but static. Others just shivering wrecks, never going back. And Elijah was on his way here, so I couldn't stop to see if it was something I could fix. If you can even fix what happened to me when they jabbed the electrodes into my skull and turned my head into a flashlight. Then I got here, and my voice got severed. Now I have a new one. Another thing Elijah you has know, to really answer for. She up, and she, she doesn't know that. Oh, oh, I didn't know this was a dialogue thing. Hold on. Dean. Dean Domino? Why would he want to torture me? He's if he wanted to do that, he could keep his singing career going. Or keep staring at me. He wasn't trying to torture you. He needed to alter your voice to use some you do know this was a thing? Vault. Of course. That I didn't makes sense. Know. Are you upset? I've done worse. Much worse. And for more hopeless causes. And I will again. Got some questions. Wow. Alright. I'm just glad I can answer you now. She's a fucking soldier. Yeah. I've been he can't the only I think we've already been through yeah. this. Any chance he's, he'll see reason? Try and reason with him. See what happens. He's so lost in his technology. I don't think he even understands why anymore. Good luck. He's not an easy opponent. If I can, I'll help. Might be able to figure something out. So you want Vera's dress? Yeah. There it is. And if you want another one, there's another one in a dresser somewhere. I really need to. I want to give it to Veronica. Like, I know we're probably going to... I don't know if we're going to do Veronica's quest or not, but I just never wanna give her, gave her a dress. I'm... Absent. Absent. The Green Fairy. I wonder if Costco still is absent. I'd like to try. I fucking love Costco. Ooh, piece of candy. More chips. Hello, hello, hello. 
Lock security oh, dog. We're going on, man. Oh, Actually, there's something really interesting today that um, nobody can in can intimidate. No, imitate uh, Chris Chan's voice, and everybody's just doing a rendition of. Oh, why'd you do that? Are, are you wearing it? I thought you yeah. repaired it. No, I just want to see what it looked like on a man. Sick. I think it's really interesting that they make it so that, like, when you put on Vera's outfit, it becomes a... Fallout 4. No fault is lost. Yeah, that's... Yeah. They find a way to... Oh, wow. Open it. Find a way to open it. Oh, I have to use thing. Chuck, use thing. No, how, thing. Do I get her, how do I get her over here to do it? Uh, wait, talk to her? Actually, if I remember correctly, I think. You sure you still want me here? Callers and all. I had some of the questions. We've asked her every question, right? All right? If we've explored all dialogue, I think what you have to do, actually. I think what you have to do is you have to go back down to the lobby right. and use the terminal there to, the like, loop uh, uh, Vera's, um, like, recordings. Although I thought there was a way that you can do it with... I don't know. Oh, there's a... Getting on it. You have to turn off the gas and turn off the radio. That's on the radio. See the radio on the floor? Oh. I was gonna shoot the road. Wow. The toast. Another stim pack for the collection. You have the last ride. That's all I need. Now, go to the main lobby terminal. Saturday night this does the same thing. Oh. Flambe cut. <laughs> A cut of flambe. Flambe cut. Flambe? flambe? You know, I knew somebody once from Flambe. Uh, Is that video of David Lynch? Did you explain this part of the movie? No! <laughs> he won't explain his stuff. He's like, if you don't get it, that's your problem. You shouldn't be watching a movie on your fucking telephone. Chuck's got like no reach. Chuck's got zero vertical. He doesn't shit, he doesn't piss, he gets no relief. Dude, none. Use that guitar right there. Access music controls. Retrieve. All those things. And then, uh, I guess that's it. Oh, so you didn't finish that one. You gotta shoot him in the head. Fuck, just fucking go. They do look pretty cool. Got him. Yo, it's 
sucks. What's that? Honestly, the hardest part, like, with, like, you know, the speakers and all that, like, it's right before getting into the vault. You're back. You sure? I found the praise. You did. Looks like even the old world can't keep you out when you've got a mind to get in. So, I just rasp out some words and the vault opens? That woman, the starlet, she didn't build this place. Why would the builder do that? He built this whole place, place just not around. sure, it doesn't feel like a casino. Maybe there's trust issues with what this place for her feels like. It's yeah. possible. This place is immense. And it still has power, food dispensers, security. Is it all for pre-war guests or for her? Oh. I believe he loved her and wanted to protect her. Too, Too much. much, yeah. Love makes people do strange things. I won't argue that. It can drive you crazy sometimes if you can't connect. If they loved each other, then they were together. I suppose that's all that mattered. They died She's together. She's in that side room, dead, because the casino wouldn't let her leave. And who knows where he is? I have no idea. But the phrase is contained the lyrics to a song. All right. If you go down there, are you prepared? What if you don't come All right, back? dude, steal these fucking chat, these gold bars. Uh, I've got you to come down. It'll be responding to your voice. I just wanted to make sure you're ready. When you go down there, that may be it for us. We won't be needed anymore. The one who made these callers, he'll follow you down there. And he won't let you leave. He's not one for sharing. Never was. Perceptions. That's why you're waiting. You're gonna, what? You're gonna kill him. Is that? I... I can't let him leave here. Look, you've done so much, and he's not gonna show himself until you go down there. Do you trust me? If you do... Let's go do this. I can't let go. No, I think Every time I've thought about it. Sorry. I've lost him so many times. He needs to die. What happened here with us? He's... He's done so much worse. Let him come through the... Let him come through the suites. Follow me. If he escapes, you'll still be here waiting. If you try and kill him, I can't let you do it. If you die, you'll kill us both. Let him come through the suites. You have to promise me. Promise me you'll deal with him. If I see him, I... Wait, she can't kill him? She wants to. I think the way I understand it is... She wants to, but she can't bring herself to do it. Yeah, because technically, like, it's riskier for her to kill him. It's better for him to go into the vault after you mm -hmm. and just follow you down there, and then you deal with let me, him. Let me deal with him. All right. All right, I'll... But I'll need to leave this floor. He'll pick up my collar and... Don't tell me where you're going. I'll find you after this. I... Never mind. Let me get the vault open. Begin again. But know when to let go. <laughs> Sounds like you. That's pretty cool. It's, I mean, you, there you go. Feels like the cloud crawled in my mouth and died. Whoa. Begin Whoa. again. Hello, Dylan. <laughs> yeah, I'm already reading it. It's true. I, I wish you luck in the vault. Elijah, he's tough to pin down. Yeah. This is night, pristine voice. Oh boy, here we go. Here we go. All right, dude. All right. Seven gold bars. It's fucking right. rock. There's gonna be a lot. We're gonna need to do a lot of hard saving at a certain point. But let's uh, let's fucking do this, dude. I fucking wish I could smoke cigarettes dude, just so badly. I oh never mind. What? I wonder if you if you could get a way to get the sonic emitter if you could get rid of those shields. I fucking wonder if you could. 
That'd be crazy. That'd be so funny. Just fucking <laughs> go right in. All right. Well, hey, yeah. Chuck. Later, Eliza. By the way, that elevator protocol thing was just saying that once uh, the vault is like locked or whatever, if security is awoken, then the elevator goes up and you can't escape. Really? Yeah. Here we go. This is so hard. Back up. This is so okay. Hard to shoot that. Yes. Yeah, so what you gotta do, if I remember correctly, you gotta shoot that one, and then you have to you have to like duck, jump down, but then you have to like run to a corner where like the other speed. Oh, actually, you know what? I'll just let you do it. Tell me. Well, no, I've because never... you have to shoot that first. Shoot that first. Now, I believe if you go to that room, you're good at first, but then if you get closer to like down there. They'll start to go off. So what you have to do is you have to down to the right. Okay, see you there. Go in there and go all the way to the right corner, right up there. In there, yeah. Get good. Now stop here. Wait a second. Um, we're, see, and that's what I'm thinking. But like, uh, yeah, yeah, that's what he was. That's saying. why we wouldn't be able to test yeah. it unless we had uh, cons we I'm used not. console commands. Yeah. Okay. Um. Oh my, did you quick save here? Yeah. Cause this part gets so fucking hard. I don't even remember what to do. There's one. Yeah, there's a lot. This gets really difficult, dude. You, 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 you. It goes, it goes, it goes, it goes. I wish I could fast. Say no, I'm gonna kill you, Steve. Do it to me. You experienced it. Yo. Yeah. It goes, it goes, it goes, it goes. Fuck. There's a shielded one up to the right. When you went there. Up, yeah. Up around there where you were just looking. There was one. What do you mean, what is? What do you mean, Papa? It stopped for a second. I remember this part now. You have to literally run to that terminal to turn it off. Oh, but you also have to shoot that thing. It's so hard. Yeah, but that's what you have to do. You have to shoot that thing, and you have to get to the terminal in time. You leave it at the big mountain to teleportation to grab it, but actually, you know how. Yeah, there's no way you can draw that box and put this in the box. Yeah. That's not even a sentence, and it made sense to me. That's how much. No, I'm telling you, it's really fucking. <gasps> oh, I remember how I did this last time. Before you even go, turn around behind you and see if you can shoot it from where you're standing. What do you mean? Don't move. Oh. Don't move. Turn around. Yeah. Try to find a way to fucking shoot that thing. Even if you have to go run back to your spot. Run back. I think. I tried to MLG it. That was funny though. See if I could do it. MLG, oh god, dude. <laughs> MLG pro gamer move. Oh no, fuck! <laughs> no, that's what I'm saying. You have to find a way to do that, but you also have to get to the terminal. No, but I'm thinking if I can shoot it drop down, I'll, I'll have enough time to run around because it'll probably be, give me a, a sweet spot somewhere in between. Maybe. Let's see it. Fuck. You see, I could do that. Yeah, I hear, I hear. There are cameras. This is what we call a pro game. 
Whoa, you fucking piece of shit. The one time the game wants to fucking help me out so I can fucking do something. 360 no scope. Yeah. Dude, I'm, I'm about to start fucking streaming Black Ops 1. I bet it's filled with bots. Like, I bet it sucks. Probably, unfortunately. <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait. So watch what? No, but the one. Well, the one was still active. So you see. What the? F it was the other one that was still active. Damn. I said damn, Daniel. Well, that actually kind of cool, though, wasn't it? Yeah. Got it. <laughs> now you just gotta run to that terminal. are shut off though fuck you were literally like your like head is just like half like pulled apart it's like Hold wait on a second okay thanks all right fuck that's harder yeah what put your gun away you move faster with that's your gun valid. away Now the guards. This part, oh my god, bro. So if, if I remember correctly, all I remember is I went left. <laughs> the skull starts expanding, excuse me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, you have to go left right away. Jump that. To the left, to the left. And hit every terminal and just switch the guards around and don't get caught. Yeah, this one, do that one. Um, I don't even remember, yeah, it's, yeah, sure, that one, sure. Why not? And then, uh fucking hide from him. Okay. Let him, let him, let him go. Just, uh, just, just go, go in a sneak mode. I don't remember this being this long. Let him go. I also spent 45 Your hours. light's on, by the way. Fuck it. There's a... Okay. Nice. I know what I'm doing, don't worry. <laughs> I know what I'm doing. So far, I took the points you raised and called today. I took the- can you read this? I'm sorry. Mr. Sinclair, I took the points you raised in the call today to heart, and I hope my answers offered some reassurance. What are we providing- what we are providing is an exclusive, comprehensive technology, but more importantly, we want to address the concern you raised for protecting your guests from threats, specifically the growing communist threat from the Chinese. Security is NE's top concern. There is no reason to provide a service service that you cannot defend. You should, and sh should the current situation lead to increased hostilities, an emergency broadcast emitter has been placed inside select hologram emitters at the Sierra Madre. In case of a nuclear attack, holograms will defend their stations with lethal force to protect the guests under their charge. If you wish to make sure that those who come to your villa and casino have the means to defend themselves, I assure you, you need look no further than the EBE. It is a proven technology, and anyone who decides to attack you or your guests will regret any aggression. Martin T. Harris. P.S. Any chance we could ask you to have Miss Keys sign an autograph for us? It won't reduce the price, although I could see about sending a few extra systems your way. Oh, and I'm beeping too. 
Didn't realize I was beaten. I don't remember this. I really don't. Do you really not? I really don't remember this. Treasure from the Goonies. Yeah. <laughs> I think I've only ever seen the Goonies once, and I don't even think it was the full thing. What, that you've only seen the Goonies once? Yeah. That's okay. I've seen, I think I've actually only seen the Goonies full, like in one city without commercials, probably like once. I saw it once at Olive's house, and I remember, no, I'm sorry, I saw it once in Spanish class. And I remember going, this fucking sucks. <laughs> I was like, this is boring. I was like, you people like this shit? Which if you like it, that's fine. Nah, I, I don't like hate it or like, like it. I just kind of am like, it's a thing. I can, it's one of those weird movies that as I was watching it, I could like, See how it could be somebody's like favorite absolutely, movie. Absolutely. Like it just has this like almost like even even though like I watched it as an adult and like I didn't watch it as a kid, I still watched it and felt this feeling of nostalgia for some reason. Mm -hmm. Oh. Good. Oh yeah. So you're gonna want to go around. That. <laughs> I don't know. When I watched it, I was like, this is. Yeah, I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Absolutely. You know, when you do Mothership Zeta, you can take off your space suit in space. Just a little fun. It's just so random, you know. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It's just one of those random haha -ha moments. It's so quirky, dude. Why are we just doing this? Why are you running? Why are you running? Why are oh, you, you see that? That makes sense. What a... Why is that? Shit. What are you doing? Are you I don't know what it is. The place you're trying to get through? Mm -hmm. oh, okay. <laughs> All right. No, you went forward. Can you explain? Wow! Yo, look at you! <laughs> what? Oh, cause it's no clip. Yeah. When no clips on, you die. It's just why do I drain you, Papa? Why did you say fun fact? Aliens are aliens. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I'm just gonna say. I. Papa, why are you... Hyper Skull! Are you drained just because you just want it to be done? Like, you want us to be through it? Because I feel you, dude. I feel the same way. What the fuck? There's no thing about security here? Vault sec Disengage Vault sec security protocols. Yes. Oh, my God. Same. Still beeping. Again. That's fine, Papa. You can like the Goonies. I didn't grow up with it, so I, it's not for me. Okay, so we're here now. Stand in front of the vault and hard save. Stop, stop, stop. Hard save. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Go in. we go guys this is it this is it <laughs> wait a second clan all right first things first walk in and take everything a quick save okay all right take every gold bar 
take all the ammo, take everything, leave no stone untouched. Yeah, probably. Actually, definitely. What am I saying? Look in there. If I were you, I'd take everything in there. Because why not? Um. Yeah, dude. Take everything. Do you know how to do this? What, get out? Yeah. Yeah, dude. I'm telling you, though, like, again, multiple. I do it with multiple hard saves, so I don't know how you're whole with. I don't know. Tell me with, what to do. No, I'm telling you. So. Who is your daddy and what is he? So, do you have everything? Oh, oh there was a gold bar there. Was Once you in have. Here when the bombs dropped? I don't know. Oops, some pre war money on the ground. Oh, we don't have a stealth boy, do we? Nope. You wanna look it up quick? Wait, what do you mean look it up quick? Look up what the, the, the ID for the stealth boy is. Oh, yeah. Cause yeah, fucking, unfortunately, we can't do it without. Cause I'm gonna do something quick. A lot of people don't know you can do this. What did you, where are you? to the terminal and it says the terminal's locked? Yeah. I feel like that's not right. <laughs> the eyeglasses do be kind of quirky. I know people who talk about that. I don't. Disengage vault security protocols? Yeah. That's not very true. You should be able to go to that terminal. Look up a stealth point. Mira, Mira keys. I'll just extract it. Mira. Mira. Two, Two Mira. Mira. Hold on. Mira, you're reading this. My fears have come to pass. This is an apology. I hope you realize what my last words meant to you. If so, they have led you here. And this place will keep you safe. I know what they meant for me. And I fear they have trapped me. I've extract, extracted the previous entry after our conversations today. It can't have it can't have been easy for you, and I am sorry for all I put you through in silence. I know while you do not love me, you did not mean any malice in what you did. I know your plans to rob the casino with Dean before you told me. Hearing it from you didn't make it any easier. For what it's worth, I'm glad you told me yourself, and I understood the tapes he had in his possession. I don't, I do not think either one of you realized what your addiction stemmed from. However, however, and that is the tragedy in this, I suspect the world would not have believed you. Regardless, I so respect your desire to keep from others. When first building this villa, this casino, I meant it for you. As the world seemed to race headlong toward war, it became part of my desire to protect you. Loans, funding, I poured into the casino's construction. I knew it would not matter when the war came for us. It was my means of creating a, a shelter, a defense in the world. It was a, a, def a defense if the world was bombarded in radiation and bombs. When Dean revealed his plans inadvertently through our introduction, I realized what had happened and how I'd been tricked. For a time, my thoughts were dark. I changed the casino's vault from a shelter to a trap, as I knew the first one to enter would be Dean. He would die down here, and I would have been, and it would have been by my own hand. By his own hand. I'm sorry, by his own hand. I fear, however, that I've overstepped myself. The only safe place in the casino is the vault. I have tried to rewire the system, change the protocols, and I cannot do it. 
I will do one last check on the pipes by the edge of the outside platform to see if anything can be done. I fear it is useless. If you come down here, do not access my personal entry. It contains only a message from Dean, and it will seal the door, and you will have no way out. Even the elevator is designed to automatically return when the door is closed and will lock in place. There should be enough in the vault to sustain you until help arrives. I am assured that there is enough medical supplies down there to keep you comfortable. It's really long. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the hologram should defend the casino from any attackers, and the hologram bacon, vegan, uh, in the villa will broadcast the emergency signal to others so they know you're here. But the emergency beacon comes off as just the, has your life been, the, the, yeah. When danger is past, rescue will come. I hope you were able to read this. I know that, I, and that, and know that I like you. Mm. Do not read the personal accounts. No, don't. I already hard saved. I just want to show, but not a lot of people know this happens. Oh, okay. okay. So I want to do it. Dean, if you're reading this, this is goodbye. You'll have many years to read this message. Uh, why you smiled in my face and held a dagger to me. And why, I'm sorry, why you smiled in my face and held a dagger to me, I don't know. You were rich, respected, and even admired. Loved by many. When you finally pass away down here, either, either by your own hand or starvation, know that your greed has led you here. For no reason I can understand. You have made a habit of using others for your own ends. Now the Sierra Madre is your reward. Whatever you use blackmail, whether you use blackmail or force, or even play to Vera's greed, it will not help you down here in the vault. Greed has led you here. I hope it leaves you as empty as you've left me. The door is sealed. The elevator has left. Even, even Vera's voice will not unlock it. Know that on the night of the gala that I shall raise a glass and, and whisper, for, 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 for Fortunato. Fortunato. In, pe in peace. In patre, in pace requias. Oh. Requiescat. For, for tu, Fortunato in pace resquiat. For, I don't know what the fuck that means. That's fine. Mahalo for him, No, I think that actually. In, in pace resquiat, I think means rest in peace. Oh, that makes sense. Back and yeah. now you're locked. Let me just get out. And now we're locked down here forever. So Are that's something like this. Yes. The courier, lured by the promise of the Sierra Madre, could not escape. Once inside the vault, the right. casino did not let go. When the courier finally passed away, the casino created a new hologram to walk with the other ghosts that filled its casino. It was a pre-programmed homage intended for another. It assumed a new meaning in the likeness of the courier. A means of allowing even the dead to begin again. I just wanted to do that quick. You know why, yeah, you know what Kyle knows because that's, that's some Assassin's Creed Ezio shit. Requiescat <laughs> That's what he would always say. We work in the dark. You know what? I was never a big Assassin's Creed fan, but the one thing that always stuck with me is Ezio Aldatore de Fretz. I don't know why the fuck Ezio's, Ezio's full so name, cool. his full name stuck with me for some weird fucking reason. All right. All right. So now we're going to read. Oh, actually, hold on. No, we're not. Did you find the content? Yes. ID? Yeah. Found it a while ago. Oh, wow. Am I not working quick enough? Form ID. Here you go. Uh. Get rid of the security. Oh fuck. It's been so long since I've played those games. I like miss- Which one do I click on? Vera. To Vera. Vera, if you're reading this, go to dead, to bed, to dead. Do not read the personal account accounts just to do Vera keys and then leave. And 
and here we go. You. You're in the vault, finally. After all this time. We are a The Sierra Madre. Mine. This fucking Don't son of a bitch. Don't go this goddamn son of a bitch. This goddamn son of a bitch. There may be more traps down there. Another security system. Still hiding behind images and screens, I see. I, I almost feel like at this point he like Chuck would be so pissed he'd be like you've got a lot to answer yeah, for. Right, right. Do I? For what? Your greed, curiosity. You came here on your own. No one held a gun to your head. I've seen your Pip Boy archives, your map markers and notes. You picked up the Sierra Madre signal just as I did. You couldn't resist. I mean, I paid fifteen dollars. So if you feel I have a lot to answer for, no. The blame isn't on my shoulders. Might as well have put the collar on yourself. How did you access my pip? I, I feel like... Uh, before this goes any further, I have questions. Curious? You must be. We have time now that you've done your work. And our interactions have been too one-sided, even for my tastes. What, what do you, you want, want from the Madre? What do I want? Weapons. Security. A citadel of my own. The Madre is all these things. It's a fortress. A weapon. A chance to begin again. Once I unlock its archives, I can carve the Mojave into any shape I choose. I don't understand how the Old World Casino helps you do any of that. The cloud is unique in my travels. Its proximity to the Sierra Madre isn't a coincidence. Right now, it protects this casino, preserves it. It can be used to preserve other old-world relics and cleanse them at the same time. And as much as I've researched hologram technology, the big empty facility was clear. Only the Sierra Madre got holograms working properly. Properly? Are you kidding me? The holograms here kill trespassers. That's what I want. Dump one of those emitters in the middle of any battle, no defense. Except breaking the emitter. It's like holding it. <laughs> like, uh, yeah. Can fight it. Only watch it burn. Just one's a portable army. Arm it. Anyone stands against you dies. If you're sec if you secure that, that's all you want. Or something else. Oh wait, no, no. No. There's one last thing I want from the Sierra Madre. It's bounty. The machines that fill its streets, its corridors. They provide, provide almost anything. Perhaps in the pre-war yeah. era, they were commonplace, things to dismiss. Now they are far more valuable. You know it. They helped keep you alive. Yeah, it gave me fucking 500 fucking, fucking stim stim packs. Can't argue with that. Yeah, so literally. Food, supplies, medical assistance, ammo, make more collars, even print currency. Make more collars. Make more make collars. collars. We just talked about this on the Elijah on the podcast, and that's like one of the like, like, we can help people, we can enslave them, but we'll help them. Like, that sounds a lot like somebody else. The Sierra Madre can and build them, using its technology with the right he's, Yeah, but, but... He's way more evil he, than yeah. fucking Kaiser. You're nothing more than a killer that aspires to aspires yeah, the mass. Yeah, literally, person. yes. If I was, I'd have set off your car long ago. The collar ensures compliance. He kept your collar off for his own selfish ends. Think about it. Would you truly have gotten into the casino without those collars? No. Human <laughs> nature is against us always. Did you know that I had to keep adjusting the collars? Keep changing the rules to make this moment possible? What are you talking about? Every time, even with collars clutched at their necks, they would betray each other kill each other to get inside the Sierra Madre. It... It was insanity. They could have had it all. It was so close. And... And they kept turning on each other. Again and again. Cracking the Sierra Madre was difficult. But cracking greed, that was more difficult. So the dead man switches with him. So you answered madness with madness. When your life is tied to another's sacrifice and cooperation. Oh, hello, thank you. They can be conditioned, learned, and 
and you can focus on the matter at hand. The dinosaurs are pre-war thing. Pre pre-pre-war thing. Control. Um. You know it better than anyone. Yes. Or I hope you do. It doesn't. Uh. Matter. Yeah. A pre-pre-war thing. Yeah. yeah. A pre-pre-war thing because. Uh. Well, I don't know. Because the dinky dino. Yeah. Well, wait. Would you consider the time the dinosaurs were alive connected to, technically, the pre-war era? Because then, dinosaurs are just pre-war. Yeah, they're really far back pre-war, but technically they're just pre-war. But I think pre-pre-war... Is, like, before the before pre-war. Before even the war. So, right. like, you know what I mean? Like, before there was even, like, the concept of the war, there was... Technically, there were two wars. There was when the meteors came, and then there was when the nukes came. So, pre-pre-war. Yeah. Make sure you uh, follow us on YouTube, and within a week, I will have a 15-minute video essay. No. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> make sure you fucking keys for these collars. Control um, the Sierra Madre. How did you get me here again? Everyone asks that. Should be asking how they plan on blaming. It only takes putting a collar on one to begin the chain. One with a collar may chain another, and that one another, and traps all over the wastes. The chain ends with a super mutant. Although with him, the collar wasn't even necessary. He only needed guidance. Guidance. We already know. I. I don't know if I... I don't really, really see a point in asking so someone else with a collar because we know it was Dog. Mm -hmm. Dog took us here. Someone else with a collar. You still have to. Well, that was weird. Did you hear that? Yeah, it didn't it went, sound like it was filtered. Yeah, it wasn't. How did you find out about the monster? It started with a setback. Fire's blood. Beneath the sun. A sun so close you could touch it. Moments like that, however, failures can provide the Clarity. Oh yeah, you seem like you have a lot of clarity. What happened next? After that, I wandered alone. Saw the storms of the divide. Walked among the ciphers of the West. Traveled to the big empty. I heard the signal. The woman's voice, the Sierra Madre, promising a chance to begin again. Reverse my fortunes. All. Oh. Nonsense. I tracked the signal. Came here. Scouted the city, using other hands. Kept dying on me, killing each other. You. You got the farthest of all. A sun so close you could even touch it. Sounds like someone spent a little too much time with the followers of Adam. <laughs> Where did you get these collars? The collars? They're pre-war tech. They're technically I suspect no worth I suspect this was the compliance issues before the it's one of a series of models. Okay, let's not. fucking talk about that for a second. I suppose they had a compliancy issue pre-war. Not thinking like, okay, people just didn't listen, so they threw collars on them. Now, this was used for slavery. This was used to demean to, to people, to make them less than human. That's how he sees this. People just didn't listen. Like, you yeah. know what I mean? No, it's like, literally... Like, you know who words it really good when... Veronica says that no. Veronica, when Veronica <laughs> says, she talk when she talks about Elijah, she says she says that like <laughs> he he got to a point Elijah did where if he could have just turned everybody into a robot who would just fucking do what he tells them to, he would. Yeah. Elijah literally just, he just wants, wants control. To, he wants to literally be the only one left. He just thinks that the only way to like save humanity around him is for him to be the only piece of humanity left. Yeah. He's not a good man. He's the most evil character in yeah. Fallout New Vegas. Yeah. Especially. Because Kaiser Kaiser has a set of rules. And he's just like here's the thing is I almost feel like Kaiser is just misguided. And like he's he's like his I feel like he, he has, has the, the right, right idea. But he has the right idea but it's being done the wrong way. Yeah. Whereas it, it, I think Elijah's just literally insane. Like this is the way I look evil. at it. You know, you know the old phrase of, like, you catch more flies with honey than you do with vinegar? I don't know what that means at all. You catch more flies with honey, meaning that, like, flies like sweet shit. Like, if you leave soda, if you leave a cup of soda out, flies are going to attack it. 
But if it, there's going to be flies all over it, like on a hot summer's day. Mm -hmm. But if you leave a cup of vinegar out, you might get one fly or two flies. Like you catch more flies with honey than you do vinegar, meaning, like, you want to influence people, you want to gain the trust of other people. You gotta make it sweet. You, you, you're, you gotta be a good guy. You're gonna get, you're gonna get more results. Any, any person you've ever worked for, if they were a dick, you never, positive reinforcement works better than negative reinforcement. Yes, that's, that is something I did learn in, um, college. Yeah. yeah. So, like, if you work for somebody, like, I used to work for a guy, and he would be like, hey, do this. And he was new to like managing something, and I was working like a like a food position, right? And the boss came over, was like, "Hey, how's his name was Dave?" He goes, "How's Dave doing?" I was like, "He's all right." I was like, "I can tell he's never done this before, though." He's like, "Oh, why?" He goes, "Because he wants me to do something." He goes, "Hey, do this," instead of "Hey, could you do this for me?" You know what I mean? Like it's a nicer way. Like him yeah. saying, "Could like he's my superior," but him saying, "Could you do this for me?" is yeah. It makes me feel like I have control of the situation. My boss told me to do something. The dude who's in charge of me told me to do something. I'm going to do it. But because he wasn't like, do this now, and like a dick about it, right. I did it. And I was, oh, yeah, no, dude, yeah, no problem. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? So, like, Kaiser is vinegar. He'll get people on his side. But Elijah is a fucking gun in your mouth. Yes. There is no option. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like... Yeah, of course. Showing them one color exploding and making them realize that they don't comply. You'll have a fate. Absolutely. And that's why you find them in Little Yangtze. Yeah. Yeah. Easier to make adjustments. Unreliable in other ways. Notably radio interference. They're pre-war tech. They're pre-war tech, Fahrenheit. <laughs> <laughs> uh, where did you get them? A place far from here called the Big Empty. There two others there. A woman. And a man, a courier. The woman was familiar. The other. I don't know what happened to him. I've never heard of <laughs> yeah. I just want to see what happens. Just out of curiosity. Well, it's probably going to be some actual, like, he's just going to describe it because... He empties a treasure box. A scientific graveyard of old world. A hollow rifle, the Saturnite alloy, the hologram technology, hibernation chambers, securitrons, the callers. Even the suits attached to those things stalking the villa. That's only the surface of what's there. Right now, the Sierra Madre is what I want. You don't want it, you need it. Um Now that I'm down here, are you, or now that I'm here, are you coming down? No. I'm not going to take the chance while I'm so close. Not this close. No. Not again. I can wait. Afford to be careful. You? You're locked down there. This is the only entrance. And I have free reign of the Sierra Madre. I have time. More than you. Dylan? Besides, there might be more traps. I'll send more scouts in. Yes, others. You're resourceful. Don't want to leave anything more. Chance. I agree with you. I actually just had this conversation with a friend of mine. He was saying that he was living with a guy, and the guy kept, like, overstepping his bounds. And he freaked out, and he was like, what the fuck? Like, you're always doing this? And he was like, I felt bad about it. I go, yeah, but he'll never do it again. Like, if something happens, and I'm like, hey, man, could you not do that again? They'll push. People will push. And they'll say, like, how far can I go? And they might not do it, like, on purpose to be malicious, but it's just, like, a human thing. But, like... If somebody crosses you and you're like, if you ever fucking do that again, I will find where you work and embarrass you in front of the people that you work with. Like, they're not going to do it again. You know what I mean? Mm hmm Like. Unless you come down here, I'll destroy the vault and everything in it. Uh, I'm not interested in the vault. I only want to leave. I mean, I already took everything. But. Unless you come down here, I'll destroy the vault, everything in it. No. I don't think so. It'd most likely trigger other security measures, if you hurt the vault at all. The builder of the casino built it to last. The Sierra Madre withstood the war. I'm sure the vault is protected as well. Besides, you wouldn't have followed the signal if you didn't want this place's secrets for your own. You're curious. Past the threats. 
Fuck, how is my repair this low? Oh, it's what time? Past my bedtime. Look at my explosives. It's past yeah. my bedtime. Fuck. Uh, go down. Is there anyone that we can d Fuck. I'm interested in the vault. I don't want to leave. Find another way. Now I'll find a way to unlock the secrets and take them for myself. You've gotten far. Any farther, try to breach the vault. You become yeah. a corpse. What's inside is mine. Anyone else touches it, tries to take it from me, they'll answer for it. Yeah, I like how you can find out how... Oh my god, too off. Yeah. And again, this is one of the good things about Fallout 4. You can back out, read something, drink something. Okay, and I'm back. Yeah. Um, that's what I like about it, Like, especially with Christine. Christine goes to most of them. Yeah, she's at the big empty end here. Yeah. And she talks to Ulysses from Lonesome Road. I'm gonna say this. To be fair, Ulysses was a tribal and only wanted to know how pe what people strive for, what's their goals, what's the point of the flag they follow. Yeah. Uly I could talk about Ulysses for a long time just because yeah. I think he's super, like, the twisted hairs as, as the idea of, like, like, Kaisar's men were not taking orders from Kaisar. They were taking the orders from Ulysses and they wanted to twist their hair much like You're his. You're talking about the white legs. Oh, I'm sorry, what was I saying? You said twisted hairs. I apologize. But the white they legs wanted to emulate imitating... the twisted hairs because yeah. of them. Yeah. Then all you need to do is wait. Be patient. You may be down there for a while. Just as I was. I can't believe it's big trapped oh, inside the casino. The road. Consider this punishment for following the Sierra Madre signal in the first place. So eager to rush ahead. Now, enjoy your reward. What can I say to convince you that I just want to go? <laughs> Silence and patience will convince me. I'll come for you in time. Irritate me, and I'll silence you forever. Look, let me out. You get in the vault, we're both, we're both happy. If you want to appease me, then do so in silence. I'll come for you, in time. Irritate me, and I'll silence you forever. <laughs> Is there a chair you can sit in? Uh, I'll check. If you want me to wait, I'll cooperate. The Madre doesn't matter to me. Mm. Compliance. Good. The others fought, argued. If they had only obeyed. I see the He's call the... has I can hear it in your voice. What? You're gonna be upset with this, but he's lawful evil. Lawful evil is dark. The best, the best way anybody has ever explained the 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 chart of like good or bad to me was Darth Vader as lawful evil. As long as you work with Darth Vader, he doesn't give a fuck. But don't work with Darth Vader. Fucking force choke in front of your people. He's Darth Vader. What's the difference between, like, lawful evil and chaotic evil, though? Chaotic evil is just doing evil for the sake of evil. A murder hobo. Like, if you started a New Vegas run and you just walk into a town and just start slashing people for the sake of slashing people. And then there's just, like, neutral evil, where you'll do whatever benefits you either way as long as it's evil. Yeah, I don't know. Stand and wait outside the vault, where I can see you from the elevator. Okay, you know how to do this now? No, I don't. Now I don't because I have never seen it exit like that. All right, so save, hard save, or quick. Sa I get, I get, I don't know. So I don't know if this is gonna work because I've never. I usually do one of those dialogue things, and he's like, "I'm coming down there." So staying in the vault, I think it'll protect you. No. Stealth boy, I don't think this I is gonna work. I'll make it. All right, go to the right. Oh, the right. I'll have the Sierra Madre spawn Madre from the right. You for me. Go right. You can't beat all the casino's defenses. Beat. Go. Keep Did going. You really think go behind the thing. Do you from me? Uh, Wait. What? Yeah, fucked up. No. 
I literally I don't. don't. Sierra Madre. It's you gotta go left. No, you can't. You, you can't. If you want to get out without the road, you can't go left. Just, you have to go out where he's really coming in. Do you think you steal from me? Do you have your? Was your is your stealth boy active? I'll have okay. the Sierra Madre kill you for me. You can't beat all the casino's defenses. Did you really think you could steal from me? He does it regardless. I feel like this is because of the dialogue. Because we can't do a dialogue thing that makes him scared. You have to do one of those dialogue things to scare him to, like, come charging down. He's like, I'm coming down right now. Put him down. Bury him. Whatever it takes. Well, he can't see me right now. It doesn't matter, the shield's up. You need to get through that shield. I don't know if this is gonna work. I'm gonna fucking figure this one out. This is I gonna know. be fun. I ain't no goddamn son of a bitch. There's shields everywhere, so. There's not shields here, though. Yeah. This is so serious. This is just an empty room. You're stuck here. No, There's. I'm not. No, but I mean, like. There's if shields. I gotta fight him, I gotta fight him. That's what happens. I'm just saying there's shields up everywhere. I, I think the I... way that this just played out is Elijah knows you're in there, so he put up the shield hoping that the turrets would shoot you down, and then once you destroy the turrets, he's gonna come through that shield and come and attack you. I mean, this looks like the exit, doesn't it? No, it's the other door. That's where you entered into. So what's the exit? Where's the exit? It's just a little bit more the like but down it's this hallway. Yeah, it's down that hallway to the left. Okay, but it's not that this. door. Are you gonna just Oh he's just uh... Yeah, he's waiting for you to die from the turret. And then when the turrets don't kill you, he'll probably come out and fight you. This isn't the way it's So, three shots. Good. Whoa, look at all that fucking ammo! Yeah. You pick up a bunch of ammo in that one, uh, thing. What's your plan at this point? I'll figure it out. I don't know, dude. I'll figure it out. If I got a fucking no-clip through the barrier, I'll no-clip through the barrier. That's fine. I was gonna say, it, okay. Because you'll probably have to either no put through the barrier, or you'd have to load that last save and find a way to convince him through dialogue to like come down there. Okay. Just like Holy shit, that's the stealth boy. What? Oh. Look at that. I always said it looked like it went on top of the pit boy. Neat. Ah. Oh, he no, he locked the thing. So I gotta kill him. Yeah? I guess. Like I said, I... This isn't how I've ever done this. Put him down. Every shot. Yeah, Chuck. Let's go, Stop. Chuck. He's invincible. It's probably because, like... Because I'm not supposed to be here. Yeah. 
What the fuck, Obsidian? He's looking at you like, what are you doing? What happened to fucking non-essential NPCs, huh? What are you doing, you damn peckerhead? Oh yeah, no, you're you're right, helpful guy Dylan. There's a lot of things we were supposed to do that we're not doing. He's like stronger than any mutant. Yeah. Otherwise, you're fucked. I don't think it's work. Oh. <laughs> we did that totally legit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Super duper MLG. Pro gamer move for y'all right here. <laughs> bada bing, bada boom. And then I maybe put two in on arm for bring it up to 30. Yeah, yeah. That's some serious pro gamer skill right there. That's crazy that we couldn't do a single one of his dialogue things to trigger that thing yeah, from happening. Yeah, we're off by two. That sucks. What are you gonna do? I don't think we got anything new. Nerves of Steel's very nice. Um... Silent Running is nice, if you wanna sneak. <laughs> we still haven't taken finesse. Super Slam's nice. You want to take it? Fin Guys, what, are you thinking? what is the chat thinking? Yeah, what perks? Sh what perks should we do? Some good ones are Super Slam, finesse, Nerves of Steel's really good. Nerves of Steel, Super Slam, or finesse? You guys pick. Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. Oh. 
Maybe this has made Chuck not afraid of the dark. That'd be cool because it's like the last DLC kind of helped with his fear of technology and this yeah. kind of helps with his fear of the dark. Yeah, I like Where's that. Night person? Oh, yeah! Right there. What do you guys think about that? Because this was pretty much a perpetual darkness. The sun goes down and night person gains plus two to both intelligence and perception and up to ten max. This part, direct, this part directly affects your internal clock and remains active inside and outside. Yeah. This would mean, we were doing a little research on this, this would mean that at nighttime, Chuck would get a negative modifier to everything but intelligence and perception. So, it would pretty much mean Chuck is no longer afraid of the dark. But he's still super tired. And when his bedtime comes around. Right. All it would mean is he's not a fucking vegetable. Right. When it comes to nighttime. Yeah. Yeah. I think I'm going to go with Night Person. I like that idea. I like it too, actually, for what we just did. Yeah. There will be other times we can take those other perks. So. I mean, there's still fucking how many levels? Yeah. Do I just We're leave? at 28, yes. As long as you want to. There's nothing else you want to do. Because you're not going to be able to come back here. I, there, we got everything we yeah. want to get. Yeah. Yeah. True that. Night Person. Night Person. Yeah. Night Person. Yummy, yummy. My buddy just fucking Night Person. Me. Yummy, yummy. Night person. Yummy, yummy. What do you know about the Wiggles? <laughs> Did you know that people weren't allowed to go backstage for the Wiggles because moms were trying to, single moms were trying to hook up with the Wiggles? Yeah, dude. Wow. Yeah, dude. Ah, stay at the Sierra Madre now. You've heard like stories it. of the Sierra Madre Casino. Yes. We all have. This story's different than the others. It's all in promise of beginnings and the ending. When Dog fell in the Sierra Madre Casino, two died as one. Dog died hungry, alone, frightened. The voice in his head died with him, screaming, furious, enraged. But the voice was gone. And Dog was grateful. At least Dog was dead, and the voice needed to watch over him no more. In the moment before their lives ended, the wall between the two personalities fell. The two became silent as they saw the chain between them. Hunger and control are twin greeds, something Dog and his shadow had never realized. It's never referred to as God. Dean Domino, entertainer, singer, thief, explored the Sierra Madre not long after he was rescued by the courier. Once he left the theater, the Sierra Madre recognized him as a guest, and many doors opened to him. He had to admit it had been built to last. During his search, he came across the final records of Vera and Sinclair and realized what happened the night the bombs fell. He felt strangely sad for a moment, and he had no idea why. Shrugging it off, his mind turned instead to where the courier had come from. Vegas still survived, out there in the Mojave. Did you find him? I don't think so. Sounds and casinos, ripe for Does the taking. Does you can find Dean Domino elsewhere? So, giving the Sierra Madre one last nod and a wink, he set off beyond the cloud to begin again. Christine, her mission complete. Found new purpose as the Sierra Madre's warden. She watched over it silently, by choice, over time. The ghost people came to see her as one of the holograms. They would watch, silently, as she walked among them. At times, Christine thought of the courier, who had kept Elijah's hand from her throat. The courier reminded her of the other courier she had met in the Big Empty, and wondered if the two had found each other at last. She did not think of them again until she heard the legends of the Divide. The Divide, where the two messengers the two couriers fought beneath an ancient flag, 
at the edge of the world. You've heard of the Sierra Madre Casino. We all have. The legend, the curses. Some foolishness about it lying in the middle of a city of dead. A city of ghosts. Buried beneath a blood-red cloud. A bright, shining monument luring treasure hunters to their doom. An illusion that you can begin again. Change your fortunes. Finding it, though. That's not the hard part. That's not the hard part. It's letting go. Wait, really? If you do it, if you do, like, the, the you good go. and... I... We... Hope you've enjoyed your stay. Farewells can be a time of sadness. Letting go... Difficult. As a guest of the Sierra Madre, you know that truth more than anyone. Frederick Sinclair believed one's life could be made anew every day. What's the demigod mode? More than it's... The in I'll, I'll explain it. It's, uh, hold on. Love. Let's to this. Life. Family. Those to care for. And those who will care for you. No fucking to way. No fucking way. Enjoys. The Sierra Madre holds little they don't already have. Out in the world. Okay. Beyond We gotta walls. check that out. Wait, no. That is your chance to begin oh. again. I hope you'll return. That would be fucking sick if that was based on you, until then, the Sierra Madre and I will hold you in our hearts. Wait a moment. Before it's just you go. Starts all over. I, Turn uh, right. God mode is just you don't have to. Um, you don't have to reload. Mode. You don't have to reload, and like you can just shoot, 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 shoot. Demigod mode. I only put it on so I can fast travel to Novak and get rid of all this shit, and then we're not going to use console commands for a while. Complimentary voucher. That's another thousand chips. It's an unaccessible, unaccessible terminal. Yeah, that uh, chemistry set over there, you can get uh, cloud residue from. Oh, Father Lars's room. Very nice, very nice. I wonder if I can. I want to see if I can. Ooh, that's fucking sick. I want to see if I can get. What's her name in it? Huh? I want to see if I can get Veronica in the, in the rooms. I actually don't think she wears them. I think I tried getting her to wear them, and I don't think she would wear them for mm. some reason. Mm, really? Yeah. Makes sense. It's a good question. I think just a, it's it's going to be really interesting, just in general, to see how Chuck like just reacts to the Brotherhood from here out, because I don't you know, think he trusts them. Oh, no, absolutely not. But, like, so, like, oh, that's very nice. Um, <laughs> uh, you know, he, he technically has dealt with the guy who was responsible for Helios 1. The main guy. Yeah. But at the same time, and it was nice, too, because he was able to interact with somebody who was a part of the Brotherhood but realized the damage that Elijah did. So he was like, he when he met Christine, he was like, oh, well, at least there's one, like, person who Wait, fucking, uh, like, actually recognizes the evil that the Brotherhood does. You know what I mean? So, what? Did I not come here with stuff? No, I did. Okay, I got it back. Yeah, you got it back. Okay. So, yeah, I don't know. I think that this is, like, shown... This may have slightly reinforced, like, Chuck's whole, you know, the Brotherhood's evil, you know, by dealing with Elijah, because Elijah now, like, you know, he kind of saw Elijah as, like, the face of the Brotherhood. He was so, an elder. Uh, yeah. He's the highest he was the member. He was the high elder yeah. who was, he was responsible for Helios. He's the only member of the Brotherhood he's ever met outside of Christine, and he was the highest member. And the first impression is always the last one. Right, so after, you know, that, I think that the only reason he might even have a slight inkling of respect for the Brotherhood, which I, at this point, don't think he has much at all, is based on Christine. Mm -hmm. 
because Christine was like, yo, this dude's fucked up. He needs to be put down. Um, knock, knock. There's a bunch of weight gone. Look how much weight is on me. <laughs> yeah. And here's my favorite thing about this. Inside Chuck's little apartment, inside his little safe, pay no mind to how many caps we have. <laughs> wow. Uh, I forgot about that. Oh, you're looking for the gold. Yeah, hold on. Where is it? I forgot about Gee. that. Uh, I passed it, didn't I? There it is. The, you were looking right Fuck, at it. Fuck, where? There that one right there. 37 gold bars. Okay. 37 gold bars. All right, let's get out of here before people see how much money I have. <laughs> and I like the idea of having a gold bar and taking it somewhere and being like, I need shit repaired. Yeah. Oh, wait, that was over here. Brotherhood will never oblige you. Christine shows that everyone in the Brotherhood, not everyone in the Brotherhood is evil and can be worked with. Absolutely. See, and that's what I'm thinking, yeah. I, I, I like that idea, but I also just like the idea. Oh, Kaiser's armor. Destruction head. Father Elijah swaps twice. Victorian. I wanted to. I'll come back and fuck with that. I might do that off camera. Fuck with everything. Uh huh. Put all of your companions in Sierra Madre armor. Really? No, I'm just kidding. Oh, I thought you were going to say, like, it did something or had a cool effect or something. No. No. I just think it'd be cool. Cool. That's... What do I have on me that's still a ton of weight? Could be your aid? You're not playing on survival, right? No. Okay. Because I was going to say, that, uh... <laughs> the stim packs, if they have any weight, no, would do. No, I'd be over-encumbered, yeah. Let me fucking see something. I, I hate doing this with a keyboard and mouse. What about your miscellaneous items? Is that it? Oh, wow. You got you got some stuff there. Yeah. A rock so. Yeah, but that's like... Box of torching. Cards and cigarettes. Oh, cards and cigarettes. Yeah, dude. You know what? You got gonna some stuff. I'm going to wind up selling... I'm going to wind up selling a lot of this shit off camera just to... How many of these do I fucking have? Oh, okay. Uh, I'll wind up doing a bunch of the shit later when I'm not on camera. X13 documents? Yes. I, I am absolutely giving it to Veronica because I've never done it. Chuck would also really appreciate sleeping for 24 hours. Yes. Because he has not done it. That's like the... I think that's one of the dresses you give to Veronica is Vera's yeah. dress. One So dresses that work, Vera's dress works, the formal wear... From like the white gloves works really? because on a woman it like it's is a, a dress. dress yeah. yeah. Um I feel like that's it, actually. I think that's literally those are the cool. only things that she'll, she'll oh, react to. Oh, wow, we were at three hours and three and a half hours. Yeah. Holy shit. That's Dr. Klein. You know, fun fact, I realized something. It doesn't really make sense for somebody who's NCR to wear NCR stuff if you're really high in reputation with them. Because if you're high in reputation with them, wearing NCR stuff brings your thing down to neutral. So it's like... Oh, you look fabulous. I'm gonna take that off. The balance ready? Yeah. No, the wasteland. The... Vexillarius? Yeah. When I need to go fuck up a town? Yeah. Vexillarius. I wish I got. I kind of wish I had a baseball hat. It's like a regular ass baseball hat. But sure you can find one. Let's hard save. Saving hard. Saving hard in the burn. All right, hold on. That's gonna get fucking old soon. Saving hard in the burn. Cool. Actually, let me do this quick. Ba bow Hello, everybody. Chris. <laughs> hey, thanks for joining us. This has been a fucking blast. Um, we're going to do this again tomorrow?
Yes, you but we're not going to do the CM Rodger. No, again. we're gonna no. we're gonna go get we're gonna go get Boone. I might do some stuff off camera just to kind of situate things, get rid of some stuff, maybe buy ammo, just kind of yeah, put you know. things together. Yeah, um, things and stuff. Bang. Uh, do you have anything you'd like to say? Um, thank you for joining us. Yes, thank you for joining us. Um, Make sure to follow us on YouTube. Um, I'm gonna I have to put something together that has like links and shit on screen. Uh, I upload everything to YouTube. Make sure you're following us there. I also have a podcast that, I'm up, that, uh, that I uh, host with my friend Olive, um, who she is the other half of Atomic Radio Hour, and she will sometimes stream and shit as well. Um, if anybody made any clips, I take all the clips and I make them into highlight reels for YouTube, so you can go and watch those, see kind of like a best of. It's not like, this is from episode four, this is from episode 15. It's just like, here's 15 clips. Bada boom, bada bing, skip it a cream, sleeve a piece. Blah, blah, blah. Um, you want to do the theme song? I do. Um, I'll just follow your lead. I don't even know what I'm going to say, but cool. uh, one, two, three, four. NCR Chuck, come on, grab Boone. We just killed Elijah. It was super cool. <laughs> Rex the dog and Eddie the eye, but the glitches never end. This NCR Chuck. Bye guys. Bye guys. Bye. Be safe. Wear a mask and wash your hands and shit. Yeah. Bang.